<laughs> hey guys! Oh. <laughs> oh, my thing moved again and one of my lights is hiding. Oh well. Thank you for the pets. How's everybody doing today? Happy Friday! And uh, yes, it, it, it is different. We are doing The Sims today. Um, but it's because Artie can't be here today. So we had to switch the days around. It's fine. It'll be Divinity tomorrow. E everything will be good. I hate how bright this screen is when I don't have anything on it. Here. I have a... <laughs> I have a random <laughs> Firefox tab. <laughs> no, we can't do it without him. We require him. Not the same. You're happy. <laughs> you, I can go home with hope of beating Kindle out of the first three. <laughs> you got it today. Uh, oh, and uh, Draco, usually when someone says they've upgraded, that means it's better. Up. But if they say downgraded, that's that's worse. <laughs> the Wi-Fi hasn't set up yet, so you're on your phone. Yeah, so fiber, that's good. Fiber speedy. Also, moving and Kev, hi guys. I know you're in here. Is Kev streaming? Kev not streaming, damn. Hello. How are you guys doing today? Are building your minis? Awesome! Can't wait to see some new ones. <laughs> You're doing all right? I'll take all right. It is not good, it's not fantastic. But it is, it is not bad. Bad is, is bad? Bad is bad. <laughs> so that's good. <laughs> and stop, stop. Stop that, Sarah. How are you, Kev? I thought you were live today. Am I crazy? Are you live later today? Or earlier? <laughs> oh, okay. I was like, I think, are you supposed to be live today? I thought you were, you were live. You're not live? <laughs> not live and in my stream at the same time is nonsense. You're not allowed to do that. Oh, I guess you're not allowed to go stream. Sorry. There goes that. He's in charge of the universe, so you can't just like say no. You've been thinking. What you're thinking about. Is it inappropriate? <laughs> I realized very quickly that maybe that was a bad question. Okay, I've decided I don't like that this is missing. Okay, see how it's like. It's because the curtain is too it's bigger than the, the window, so it's all wavy. Oh! Oh! It changed because I opened the window. Stop that! Stop it. Just stop hiding. Stop doing what you're doing. Now they're all uneven. Oh. Look it. That's close. That's good enough for now. I need to fix them. Boop. Boop. I got all out of whack when I open the window and I just haven't, I don't have the patience. They're surprisingly difficult to organize. Like the wire, it just, it, it's, you can bend it, but it, it doesn't, <laughs> it kind of is a mind of its own. It kind of just does what it wants. Yeah, how's your guys week been? What'd you get up to? Did you do anything interesting? I did some stuff this week. I did some out of the ordinary stuff. I uh, yesterday I went out with a friend 
to dinner, uh, which I don't normally do, we, uh, we hadn't really seen each other in years. Like I'd seen her on and off, uh, like around town. She used to work at the grocery store, so I would see her there. Why are you refocusing, camera? Why? There's nothing new to focus on. Oh well, I'm just a blurry smudge in your lives now. Um, and but I knew her in high school. We've been trying to to get together for a while. So we went out to dinner, and uh, we went to this <gasps> taco. For the love. I'm really good. How are you doing? Mubin's only doing all right. <laughs> the, it's been, this, <laughs> it's been uh, informed. He's only doing all right. <sighs> You're doing good. You could be better. I mean, I think there's not a lot of times in which we couldn't be in a better mood. Like, the high highs of life are very difficult to replicate in every day. Just normal stuff. I'm a fairly contented person though, so I'm usually good. Moving. So, my competition. <laughs> Sorry, <laughs> I just made a little, I made like a little scene in my head for that one, one greeting. <laughs> See, there it goes. Taco. Shut up. <laughs> no, I was gonna say it. Uh, my friend uh, took me to her favorite restaurant. Um, hey, Kendall. Welcome back. How are you doing? And my friend took me to my favorite restaurant, her favorite restaurant, which uh, I was gonna say the name, but then I realized it's probably local and I shouldn't say the name because then it'll tell you guys where I live. Um, but we went uptown and it's this vegan restaurant. It's vegan and vegetarian. So like they're, everything on their menu has a vegan option. Uh, but some things include like cheese and you can get it a vegan cheese or you can just do it normally. Sounds like an anime plot. He's only safe because of Izzy. It does sound like an anime plot. You guys should, uh, write this shit down. We'll, we'll figure out how to get that animated. And by PC, you mean your family's Chromebook, so... Your new anime plot? Uh, should we be worried? I'm gonna finish the thing about the restaurant. Because I was excited, I'm excited about it, because they have a, a vegan ha a hamburger there, and I tried it, and it literally didn't taste any different. It was so good. It was it was delicious, like one of the better burgers I'd had. I've had. It was like the texture wasn't weird. It was it tasted awesome. Would have again any time, except that it's like it's a proper restaurant, so it's a little bit expensive, and like fill the plate with fries to make up for that. Like make the patties in house and everything, so they're they're just it was so good, and <laughs> and I uh. I haven't tried one that's not good before, so I'm very pleased. Do I need to bow the TTS again? I don't know what, do the TTS again? No. No, I, um, I'm concerned about what you would use it for. <laughs> Kevin, you gotta, you gotta say nice things to Taco. I'm telling you, you're not gonna get your enemy to lovers arc if you don't make some compromises. And I think it's fair. I mean, he is taco lover. This is a very important issue for him. It's fine. You're fine with it. You think he'll come around? Have you guys ever had one of the like really good uh, vegan burger patties? because we don't have like this is the only place I've, I've been where they like properly have one that's not just it's a veggie burger which is sounds disgusting but 
I feel like we've just gone. I don't even know. You don't require tacos love. You fail to see the point of which thing. <laughs> of veggie burgers. That's more they don't taste better. This was delicious. And uh, there's lots of good reasons to be vegetarian. Especially to reduce eating the amount of beef that you consume. You reduce the amount of beef you consume. Uh, I, I was vegetarian for a year because I, I would like to be one for environmental reasons. But I really love hamburgers. <laughs> I also have trouble getting protein. Uh, because I don't, I don't like to, I don't like to eat a lot. Stuff that has protein. But this is really good. <laughs> Hi, Roscoe. <laughs> We're talking about, separately, anime plots and vegetarian burgers but like like the patties made of other things this one was made of uh brown rice mushrooms and walnuts but i don't know it just tasted like a hamburger to me i cannot taste any of these things they say is in it it just tasted like meat it was really good <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> oh, I could do that for you. I got everyone's just like, we're here in this important, you know, Paco and Kevin situation, and I'm just like trying to direct a conversation about uh vegan burgers, but but no. You never had a hamburger alternative that didn't taste like shit. Yeah, so I hadn't either. Um which is like one of the reasons that my vegetarianism didn't last. Uh, because I fucking love burgers. It's it's so good. Um, but I was saying I had one yesterday that, that I genuinely couldn't tell the difference. And I'm not like especially discerning. So if like you have hyper taste buds like Minty does, you might be able to tell. But for me, I genuinely like, I couldn't taste the difference. I was like, and I was, I knew it was a vegan burger, so I was like looking for it, you know, like you're expecting it to taste different, but it didn't. I was like, this is just a really good hamburger. <laughs> it was so good. <laughs> so yeah, that is the real problem is the cost. Uh, this was a local restaurant and they made the, the patties in house. So um, I don't know if that's more expensive it's it kind of changes uh nowadays with local stuff because transportation costs a lot now like a considerable amount more uh, gas here is i don't know what it's like in australia or in the states but gas here is like over twice as much as it was four years ago so there's a big difference with your your like there's not, sorry, there's not as much of a difference in price uh, when you're using local food. Uh, it's nice because it makes like fresh fruits and vegetables uh, purchased from the market here a more viable option. And so you're not just paying more for something that tastes better, you're actually like, it makes sense to go buy them there because uh, they're less expensive and they're better. But yeah, I, I don't know how expensive it is. Generally, I found it comes to being good food. It's made with the intent of making good food. It's actually really good, yeah. But if it's made with the intent of being purely vegan, it's usually garbage. I also find that too. Like, um, I know they make a lot of like, it's like, this is a thing, but it's, uh, but like we made it to just copy like an existing product because it's like vegans want cake, right? But, Usually when it's just like, we just made this delicious food, it just doesn't happen to have meat in it. It's very good. Uh, but also I find vegetarian a lot easier to do than vegan. I, 
I love cheese. I don't know if I could do no cheese, no milk, no eggs. Like, there are so many things made with those. Like, and I know you can get alternatives, but I know the difference. Uh, you, okay, your gas is pretty cheap there. For you guys, I don't know uh, if that's cheap for you. Like, I guess, because ours is like, hang on, let's look at gas prices. They, they went down a little bit. Oh no, they rise. <laughs> they rose 17 cents a liter uh, yesterday, I guess. Uh, we got new rules. I wanted to know. I just wanted to know what it is here, but it's not helpful. That's not helpful. Never mind. Wait, I found it. That doesn't tell me anything. 162.6 maximum total price. But that's not how gas is per liter. That's not how we say it. Huh? It's probably like one and a half right now here, which is good compared to what it has been. It was over two dollars and like some per liter per barrel. I look. I don't have time for to understand what it's saying. I just know that for the area, it has over the past like six months, it's gone down a lot. But in general, the last like year has been crazy. <laughs> like nobody can drive anywhere because it's so expensive. I feel like I missed something. Yeah, imitation burger. So this is supposed to be an imitation burger or it was called a revolution burger on the, I don't know. All I know is for me, this one tasted like me. But yeah, I, I've heard of just using mushroom instead before to like replace uh, meat. And I think that's fine, but I like mushroom, so. Gallon? I don't know. Do we use gallons in Canada? <laughs> it's like, uh, I don't know how this works. Rams for 3,500 tacos. Uh, yeah, no, we have the Honda Civic, so ours is okay. We also don't like drive places. Like we only really drive out here. But yeah, no, my friend took me out. My point was, my friend took me out. I, she was like, I asked her what she recommended. She said her friend, who also isn't vegan and has like texture problems with food, liked the burger there. And I was really curious, so I tried it and it was very good. Um, oh, that, that was all. I don't know if it, will be, it would be good for anyone, but my experience with veggie burgers is that they're not good and the texture is weird and I do not like them. And this was very good. I was pleasantly surprised and I would like, genuinely would have it over other burgers. So I was like, that's really cool. But also it was just nice to hang out with my friend who we never really hung out because we've been like, oh, it's been mostly Instagram since high school. <laughs> you drive either the ramp or a shitty holded spark with a tiny edge of the can't run the AC while coming highway speeds. Oh no, Roscoe. <laughs> I can't drive. I don't have uh, car problems. <laughs> Because I don't have a car. <laughs> I don't even know what kind of car Binti drives. I, it's red. I remember it's red. He told me I should know what kind of car he drives for like immigration questions. And I was like, I don't know what kind of car you drive. I can't remember that. He was like, you should remember what color it is. Like, I don't remember what color it is. I don't color your brother's car is. I only see your car from the inside. Red goes faster. Red gets caught for speeding faster. <laughs> I think like Taco knows exactly what kind of cars you're talking about. Like, I know he's like, aha. My understanding, my knowledge, my, my base of knowledge here is very useful. Cars. 
Cars and tacos. A 99 spark. A, a spark of 99. 99 nine spark. I just Googled that and I've gotten spark plugs. Um, and also, apparently, there's a place called that uh, in England. Olden. Oh, I'm still getting a winning Chevrolet spark. What am I looking for? Is it a Chevy? Okay. Oh, I typed it the other way around instead of Spark Holden. I typed Holden Spark and I've got the car. Oh, but it's cute. I love cars that are like this. <laughs> Not that they can't run the AC, but but like small cars. Does that make sense? I like cute little cars. I'm sorry. You pro you probably don't want your car to be cute, but I think your car is cute. Okay, guys, go. Oh, don't get bigger. I just wanted. There you go. This is the one thing that comes up. What year am I looking for? This is adorable. You have a 1999 Holden Spark. That's a Chevrolet, but this one, the stuff. I assume if they're the same, they're the same thing. I like it keeps showing me this purple one. It knows. It knows what I want. I spend a little bit the very top one. Little this little nerdy one. This is a wiki page. It's not gonna just open the you're not you don't wanna open just the image. You we had to go to Wikipedia. Aw. Tis <laughs> all I have left I give to you. You know you could have used them to play noises at me. <laughs> This one kind of looks stupid. <laughs> why are its headlights up there? Why is it like, why are they like here? Why is, why are they here? They should be like here. Because <laughs> that's a good reason. Thank you. <laughs> it looks derpy. Is that, do people still say derpy? Because it looks derpy. That's the word I would use. I really enjoy it. It's just, it's cheap. You can be cheap without looking that stupid. Well, now that I know what your car looks like. Research has been done. Everyone says your car looks cute. I just like little cars. But I, I don't know. I don't know if cars are supposed to be cute. I mean, they also kill people. So I suppose they're cute and dangerous. Oh, am I looking this one up to you? E O W G T I. It's like, do you want to go to the Canadian Revenue Agency or look up Divinity Original Sin? Either. This thingy? I am looking up all your guys' cars. Older. I don't know. I have to have a year or it won't. It'll just bring up like a 2019 one. Yeah, Cause like, if you need to guess. These ones. 2016. I don't know if it's cute. It's just kind of a car to me doesn't have a particular emotion associated with it. Like a little grill in the front. <laughs> this looks like a, like an advertised, like it's touched up. They've touched this car up. Imagine the bot, the, the standards, the beauty standards for cars. They have to put them in Photoshop. 
It looks like it's happy. Oh, okay. Because of the grill that does this thing. That's like beep boop. And to find out, I mean, I know, I'm pretty sure I know what a, a Corolla looks like. My dad had a Corolla. Yeah, my dad had a, multiple Corollas when I was growing up. Uh, Cause you know, eat, sleep, drive a Toyota. <laughs> Cause apparently that's a thing. We've only ever owned, uh, actually, no, that's, that's not true. I was gonna say we only ever owned Honda and Toyota, but my, one year my mom had, for a little while, we had a Hyundai, which was just less good. Oh, right, 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 right. I'm doing it, I'm going. Why did this, why did this song end with? <sighs> <laughs> Thank you for a uh, scary me. I don't know who did that, but. <laughs> oh, damn, the ninja. Kwasaki Ninja, apparently. There's no other option. They're all ninjas. Is there a one without a ninja or are they ninjas? This looks like your motorcycle is 14 years old and going through a phase. <laughs> It looks like, it looks like Razor made a bike. <laughs> like the, like the, like, the peripherals company made a bike. Uh, it's, it's very, it's very edgy, I think is what I'm trying to say. Like, look at this part. It's got like a tail. Your, your bike's a dragon. They're like, how can we make this thing look like a mythical space creature? Yours is blue. All right, and then yours wasn't made by Razor. They're all the same color. They're black and green, blue. Ah, now it's a sea serpent. That's a cool bike. I like it. Your family is very much a Toyota family and you've had yours for 10 years. Nice. Toyotas last a while. Like, Toyotas and Hondas aren't like that exciting, but they've been, in general, my experience with them is that they like last a while and they're dependable. Old Ram trucks last a while. Yeah, a lot of people around here have Ford, though. That's like a big deal. Ford? <laughs> Why fuck Ford? What do they do? I don't know anything. You had three Fords and they were all shit? I'm sorry to hear that. I've n we've never had one, so like I don't know anything about them. I just said that because, so like, I live in a place where people own a lot of trucks. Uh, and so they all have like Ford trucks, like pickup trucks, everybody. Everybody has a Ford pickup truck, that's where I live. American cars used to less, but now found on road 10. <laughs> I haven't had a very, I've never had like, my family's cars because i keep saying my cars but like this is i don't drive this is my mother or my father owning a car none of our cars have ever broken down like that we had one time we had a tire blow uh but we were okay <laughs> we got we got to the gas station before it totally ran out of air you had a 2054 focus and it blew a transmission at 5k oh yeah, we've never had a problem, so I don't... But we also... Haven't, like, owned cars for a really long amount of time, or, like, bought secondhand stuff or anything like that. So... I feel like... Kilometers, yeah. I feel like that would change the experience with cars. 
This is one of the things my dad always says that you you need to make sure you buy a nice, good new one so that you don't have any problems because it will end up costing more. I'll murder the whole of the ants. Hello, Admiral Cake. Ants? Are you all right? Um, so Roska says don't, don't own a fort. So we'll remember that. Roska says no fort. K-I-L-L-A-Z-Z-T-H-E-A-N-T-Z. Uh, for those that cannot spell, that says kill all the ants. <laughs> Why was there a motorcycle? Uh, we have started talking about cars. Uh, that motorcycle, Roscoe owns one. It was very cool. Nani? Nani? How are you? Why are there, why ants? Tell me about the ants. What's going on? For North America is pretty good. If Taco says it's pretty good, then it must be. I don't know anything, but Taco does. It's not a car, it's a motorcycle. Well, we were looking up cars, so we just looked up a motorcycle too. Unspecified murder intent? You just felt the need to murder ants? But they're not they haven't done anything to you. They're part of they're part of our ecosystem. They're part of a food chain. You can't just kill them. You and a beetle? <laughs> when I was growing up, I really, really wanted a Volkswagen Beetle, a lime green Volkswagen Beetle. No, I don't want you to murder all humans. <laughs> I don't feel like April Cake is okay. I want I wanted a lime green Volkswagen Beetle really bad, but I also was really obsessed with the color lime green. And I don't think I'd seen another car come in that color, so I was just like really excited that there were such crazy colors with Volkswagen Beetle, an old Beetle, like the ones that don't look like buggies, like the old that don't look like round. Everyone goes through a time in their life and they want a Volkswagen bug. <laughs> Do they? Compared to the average, you or average human, um, a, a little bit more than your usual, a 1968 beetle, so it old, it old beetle, properly old. <laughs> it's popular with the you make it sound like if you own a beetle, that women will like you. <laughs> how many, how many vehicles do you have, Roscoe? <laughs> it's a fire hazard, he writes at the same time. <laughs> I think uh, I think that might be an issue. Paco just knows that old buggies have overheating issues. Did I say thanks for the resub or was I very busy spelling out the ants thing? <laughs> Ants, maybe? Well, thank you for the resub. Uh, I hope that you find an ant in your house to murder to help say your bloodlust. You've decided we're done talking, Kindle. It's Sims time. Overheat to the air cooled engine in hot weather here. Oh, this can't be a habit. I'm not allowed to talk to my chat. This Kindle, Kindle, I assume you prefer gameplay as opposed to chatting. <laughs> I'm not allowed to talk to you guys. All right. The field gets so hot, it could catch fire. I'm a big streamer now. Like a big girl. I've grown up. <laughs> ah, all right, I'll move over. I'll move over just for you, Kindle, because I love you. We'll move over. Did you explain why in, there is a state in the US that requires a P to oversee the natural gas lines work? Uh, 
What's a, a professional engineer? I could try to talk while gaming, but I usually talk about what we're doing. Did Bunny drove a beetle? What does that, how does that change things? We're to go to resume. Uh, so while we were gone, there was a, oh, I have something to show you guys first, actually, before we get into this. Uh, that's related to this, nobody panic. Um, <laughs> there was a update to the game. They had a content drop for a couple of new, like, little things. Um, mostly, like, two Jewish foods. And women love tip, but oh, good God. <laughs> Physical egg. I like physical egg. All right, let's. Where did I save this video? So I could show you guys. It's either video or video two. I'm gonna guess it's video two. All right, here you go. You want to see what happened when I went to? Uh, I opened the game and I went to build some stuff. And um. And uh, this happened. So I, I reloaded and uh, took a video for you guys so you would know. I could not build because you can't build while a sim is uh, actively passing away. This is the death of Chungus, our beloved Chungus II. Are you? Going to his grave. <laughs> Everyone gathers and cries. So, uh, Jimmy Two Feet's first, like, memory of, as a child is his grandfather dying. <laughs> and this is his wife, by the way, who decided Mario Kart was a better use of her time. Which is fair. I, I thought it was really funny. <laughs> so I went to see what, she, what the hell she was doing. <laughs> and she was just playing Mario Kart. <laughs> and I was like, alright. <laughs> I got will just kind of give up. The butler, though. The butler cares. Yeah, you know? Goodbye, Chungus. <laughs> nice knowing you. What happened to his er- Jesus. Well, there it is. I never picked up his urn. I'll have to go pick that up. <laughs> there you guys go. You see his burner? Nah, just death. Hello, Panja. Good morning. Thank you for the hydrate. Nah, so I came in um, over the week to do some building because I've been really like procrastinating fixing up the rooms and getting everybody into like the correct places. Like Jimmy Two Feet doesn't own a bedroom or didn't. So I um. I, I loaded into the game and Chungus like immediately died. So I was like, well, and you can't build while someone's dying. So I had to just record it for you guys. <laughs> oh, where did we? There's a separate redeem for reservations. Yeah, there is. Uh. I, I added it because we had too many requests for people wanting to name stems when they wouldn't be around. So there is a separate one. Oh, I forgot I have my, I have my shaders on. So yeah, so Chungus, Chungus has left us, but that does mean that there is another slot in the family. Uh, and I did some building. So I'll show you guys, I'll show you guys around. You want to see it burnt down? Burning it down doesn't really burn the house down. It. We've started doing this thing where I lock them all in a room and I see how many of them I can kill with fire uh, before it gets away. But it's a bit of a process. All right, so I'll show you guys what I what I did, what I was what I was up to. Uh, so everything down here is mostly the same. Um, You'll notice the closet is no longer really a closet, but I have moved the little baby nursery that was upstairs down here. So any newborns will be near their parents because their, their parents' room will always be right here. Uh, 
little little thing and we can change this to like a toddler bed or in an infant crib pretty easy uh, so the little the little decorating very excited uh, to do that and then uh, over here you'll notice there's quite a big difference I finally 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 decided to move our uh, air s I suppose still always the legacy family uh, yeah everybody's like upset and Chuck is his wife is like gone she's busy pearl pearl has life to do uh so this is now diabetes and salim's room salim's at, at work uh so i i i gave i moved all this their stuff down and then i went like kind of nuts with the the <laughs> the like gilded pink shit because i think it's hilarious and like crazy so this is her computer which i would like to a uh, lock, lock computer for everyone but her. You want to name a sim undesired that is not happening right now. There's no, there's no sim to name. You can't, you can't just ask to name a sim that isn't here unless you want to reserve it. Okay, okay. Just so you know, you're not the first in line. Which one did I put it in? Here they are. Actually, you... You have one. You have a reserved name. You wanted me to name... Well, with, with two dots. You, do you want to? So, here's, yeah, okay. So, part of the reason we don't have more babies is just because uh, we ha we don't have space. Um, can't, no, you cannot order more. Um, <laughs> yeah, you can only have so many Sims in a household. Right now, the person at the top of the list is Kindle. Uh, the next child that will be born after Chungus II died must be named Chungus III. So the next child will be named Chungus III. We also have a redeem for the next set of twins to be named Solid and Liquid. Uh, then we also have two, I don't remember how to pronounce this word. What, what, what? Uh, Hey, Daddy! It's good to hear you guys. See you. Hello! <laughs> we're not juggling the children and we're not making them fight to the death. Um, I- why do I have to say that out loud? Um, <laughs> and then we have undesired. What about eating? No, no eating children. Again. Uh... <laughs> Anyway, as I was saying, I went a little bit crazy with the guild and stuff. I thought it was fun. So this is uh, Diabetes' computer. And we finally got Salim his own computer uh, so that he could do his writing on here. So he'll do that. And I spent I spent all this time, you guys. Look, I like, I like went in and I like added little details. There's post-it notes. There's like coffee cups and stuff. I, I kept pictures and trophies and I added that there's like a little phone there and there's you know I kept her like signed photographs and like magazines and <laughs> I just I just went nuts I was very excited this uh particular book on the wall here oh okay but I'll cut the wall uh it's it adds inspiration to the room uh, can actually I'll show you guys the rest of the house while we burn them that seems like a that seems like a good compromise. All right, we got to do a couple things before we burn them, though. So I will save. Uh, is your mom and brother on tonight, and hubby? They are. Mom and Spencer are watching a movie. Uh, Minty is here, uh, in chat. Colin's uh, username is Minty. Um, but nobody is playing with me. Usually we play together um, on Fridays, but today I had to switch days, so we'll be playing, uh, not Minty, but Mom and Spencer, 
will be playing with me uh, tomorrow night instead. All right, I've got that off. We also have to delete uh, any sort of, um, <laughs> and anything that would alert the, them to the fire, we have to make sure it's gone. I think we're good. I think that's the only one I have in this house. Um, and then, oh right, I gotta turn off free will. No free will left. Uh, free will is for, for those that are not going to die. Um, and, uh, where, what room shall we kill them in? Uh, how about the new room? I like this room. Uh, Salim, you have to come home from work. Sorry. I don't care how your boss feels. Um, we're all going to the room to die here. I think that's a good plan. All right, everybody come inside. And we'll, uh, we'll call the, we'll call the cat and the butler once we get in. Jack, where's our butler? Hey, butler! Paul, Grim Reaper's still here. All right, you can, you can all go here. Uh, maybe the cat could live? Well, if the cat doesn't make it in the room, but, I mean, who doesn't want some, like, crispy, delicious taco cat? Let's be real. Oh, here comes the cat! All right, everybody seems to be- oh no, the cat's still- all right, okay. Kitty, kitty! There you go. All right, lock for everyone. Whoa. <laughs> cat tacos! We're gonna make cat tacos. Yes, new room initiation indeed. All right, yes, so we're all- they all should be stuck in here. Oh, butler, god damn it. God damn it. No, you are definitely- you're not allowed to just leave. Where is... Where is call over? You firing up a way at, Come back! You know what? You know what? Fine. Fine. I can't... Well, there he is. Come here. Alright, nobody else is allowed to move. We'll get... Uh, we'll get Jimmy to, to play with the cat so it won't leave. Butler, come back! No free will! Okay. Lock for everyone. Okay, cool. So, this should keep everybody in this room. Uh, and I was gonna save. We don't wanna save. I, I deleted stuff. Just, yeah, death is ready. Alright, so, our, uh, local conspiracy theorist, uh, Peanut Butter has our fireworks. I should really get going now. Thanks for hanging out with me. Um, bro. Bye. Bye. Okay. Um, <laughs> thanks for hanging out with me. Okay, let's uh, do a little smattering of, of various indoor fireworks. I'll see you soon. You'll be back. You'll be back. Here, you just put that on. There you go. You look great. Just light that Roman candle. You seem to be on fire, peanut butter. Where is the cat? Oh, there he is. Freaking the fuck out. People who don't care, the butler, uh, and Sasuke. Just feeling a little bit dazed there. I like how Selim immediately gets in fear of fire. Like, um, this is not good. Anyway. And he's also tense because you children. Yeah, you guys just uh you guys just keep going. Yeah. Sometimes I think they must, you know? Right, Jimmy Two Feet, get nice and close. Oh yeah, for anyone who wasn't here for uh, the last episode, Peanut Butter is dying. Good, good. Uh, episode. Uh, Jimmy Two Feet aged up, and um, ten out of ten became evil. Uh, <laughs> so we have a very evil little Jimmy Two Feet. 
like they remember burning each other subtly being shit. Yeah, like I think, I I sometimes I think that would be like a really good lore bit for the game. You know, like they know. I I cannot believe Salim is not on fire. Like, how are you not actively on fire, bro? Going through, it's gonna get the TV. Oh, the bed's gone. No, I like how the first thing to go was like the the rug. It just it just went up in flames. That's the rug now. Oh, they have, they're on fire. Good, good. All right. So Liam's like, oh god, my wife. Oh good, death is gonna see you. But, but Butler's trying to go extinguish himself. Oh, you just you just died. You know you could have. It's fine. Don't worry about it. They can, but you know. They don't have free will. Celebrity level lost? <laughs> so Liam, since when are you? <laughs> They're coming to witness this death. <laughs> You're supposed to be burning, not witnessing a death. Come on. Just because the butler decided to do that doesn't mean you need to, to go interrupt him. I like how there's still just more sad about other things. Oh, except, uh... Jimmy Two Feet here is pleased from being near misery. The cat's just watching. Yeah, ta the taco cat is just like, uh huh. Yeah, this. I'm gonna stay out of whatever is going on over there. Uh, oh god. Oh, Pearl. You join your husband. Oh, goodbye, diabetes. I see you decided over here. Diabetes is taking her. All right, uh, if you guys would like to just get a little bit closer to the fire, that I would appreciate. Witness death, witness more death. Oh, there there goes another, there goes another one. That's good. You just, uh, no, 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 no. Come friends with your deceased uncle. Oh yeah, stand right in it. That's a good spot. I like that. The fact that they are not currently on fire. Cat was up to it. Salim, call the Hako Cat a little bit closer. Can you not? Oh, he's on fire now. Witness death. Witness death. No, you need to be burning. Witnessing death is, like, not part of your current activities. The, is the, the cat not, like, callable? Oh, yeah. This interaction is unavailable because of the fire on the lot! Instead of them making tacos out of the cat, the cat is making tacos out of them. Yeah, alright, you just- you keep burning. Oh! 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 Jimmy is on fire! Oh god, oh, okay, so leave it, uh, Sasuke is dying, goodbye Sasuke! <laughs> the group member's really backed up, there's another person over here. How'd you just gain relationship? Here, you just, just walk over there, Salim, I, I need you to be closer to the fire for, for everybody. This is a great success, unfortunately the taco cat is not on fire. Oh, <laughs> the fire's, uh, <laughs> having a good time out there. Can you just... Nope. Stuff's in the way. Like, I can't walk over there. There's a bed. Wait, where... Did the child just vaporize? Where did he go? What? Did he run off? Did I miss something? He's just not... He's just not in the... He's just not in the list anymore. But he's gone. Wait, I bet social services technically took him. <laughs> or something. Oh, we have a new butler already. <laughs> they, man, they are speedy replacing those butlers. They're like, oh, your butler died? Hang on, I, I've got this. No, it doesn't say child services took peanut butter, so peanut butter just vanished. Maybe Salim can't burn because he's the last living adult and you can't, you can't like run a, a cat episode. Oh, nope! I- I was wrong. He can definitely burn. 
Oh god. Alright, approach the taco cat. <laughs> you prefer to choose to believe the child is just pure combustible. <laughs> Oh my god, the freaking fireworks we got. What are you worried about, Bills? Yeah, you're having a bad day, dude. I get it. I get it. All right, he's just... Oh, we're getting closer to the taco. I don't think I can play with just a cat. Like, you can't... You can't control the cats in this game. Are you not on fire? Oh no, you're dying. I thought he just stopped being on fire, but no. <laughs> the Grim Reaper's just chilling in here looking at the birth certificate. Like, ah, oh, yes, life. Ah, oh, my new room! Oh god, the cat- the cat seems, um, upset. Are you on fire, or are you just- I think we discovered a while ago you can't- you can't burn the pets. Like, you can burn a child, but a pet is too much. It crossed the line. But he looks pretty upset. <laughs> the spotlight is fading! Dude, he's dead! <laughs> He's an extremely dead person. Yeah, Jack. <laughs> Jack, uh, Jack has a fear of fire now. Is the death will do that? No, we don't. We don't save. No, 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 no. Bad, naughty. Anyway. So that was great and very successful burn it down. Thank you very much. Uh, we try to kill as many sims as possible with our burn it downs and that killed all of them. Uh, so all possible sims were in fact burnt to a crisp. Good job, 10 out of 10. Taco Cat reigns supreme over this household. And time will burn again. Understandable. <laughs> all right. Uh <laughs> So anyway, back to like normal stuff. Hydrate, yes, yeah, so we'll put the fire out. Very nice room over here. Great stuff. Uh, so upstairs, I moved some stuff around. So this is gonna be Jimmy Two Feet's room. We're gonna decorate it together today. Parmenia's thirsty work, it is, I think. We're gonna decorate this room for Jimmy Two Feet. I know Jimmy Two Feet's very sad. We'll uh, we'll work on that later. Um, but you know, more Mountain Dew. Ah, oh, shit. This faded so quickly. The scar. Star faded really quick. It's gonna be dead by the end of the stream. No, I was trying to do, um, I was trying to like only charge two of the batteries and then, cause it won't go, it won't turn on if there's just one battery. There's just two batteries in it, but it will turn off. There's two, three batteries, but one is dead, but it just drains the power really quickly. All right, I'm gonna finish up this Mountain Dew while I show you guys around. I didn't do anything to Sasuke's room. I think it makes sense, although I would like to move him out of the house because uh, I'm kind of done with the media uh, production thing. Like there's nothing new we can do from that. He just keeps doing the same thing forever. There are other variations of name, but they all include stories related to a small mustache man and that's a no, ah, yes. We, yeah, no, bad, bad small mustache man. And <laughs> it's a very childish way of putting that. Uh, this is, this is now Pearl's room, uh, which I just took the downstairs furniture and put it up here, but she'll sleep here until she passes away. <laughs> <laughs> I do. And uh, I made a little, hang on, let me get like right down in it for you so you can see because the, the roof really like cuts it off. But I made a little like gamers, programmers slash like conspiracy theorists like attic room for peanut butter. <laughs> Dark. Uh, so I moved peanut butter stuff in here. I gave him, you know, movie posters. I gave him stuff he's collected from Strangerville. 
Uh, I put up all these, you know, these posters. Also, he's he likes to fish, so he has he has a here. Um, I got the listening device stuff in here, and I I kept his little gamer setup. He also has a bunch of like random files and shit uh, that he's collected. Uh, so I thought that was a really good kind of combo area. So this is like his VR and his his console gaming and his PC gaming and programming. So I thought this was really fun uh, in here. So I, I had a good time making that. It took a really long time <laughs> to do all the, the rooms actually. I spend too much time on the little details. All right, we'll finish this. And then um, I forgot to like put this stuff away, but I did clean up the like 12 million uh, matter cubes that were on the floor and I added a little shelf for us to like make more of these um, But yeah, I really do need to to reorganize this. I also need to take a sim down here and have them um, Put all of this stuff in their pocket because with the loss of the old save files uh, They don't think that they have collected this stuff anymore. So I want the game to like understand that again. And most things have been entirely restored, but not that. Ah, uh, yes. Our, our dead friends, butlers and random people. The thing I want to put here is if you get uh, an award, you uh, are able to, uh, you know, like bring it home. But Diabetes is not, She it said she got an award, but it never let me go to it. So I don't know. I, I'd like to her to get her, her award and then put it there. Oh, yeah. So we have all these cool things from everyone else. Someday I want to try to... I don't know if this will work. Because technically, somebody... <laughs> Somebody was in this book, but since we lost the file, I don't think I can bring Lily back. All right. Mountain Dew done. New Mountain Dew. We'll get into it. We've got, we've got a mother plant to kill today. We have a room to build. We have a, a new child to, to hang out with here. Um, and stop their newly found depression. Taco Cat just making biscuits. And we have, we have great actress work. M many fames to do with the, the diabetes here. So, yeah, so she never received an award. And like, I don't know why, because at this point you'd think she would have received it because there's like even more, but she's, <laughs> she's gonna be, it's gonna be done before she even gets an award. You're gonna be a level 10 actress. Anywho, uh, so, so we don't actually have anywhere to put gravestones anymore. Um, so I'm just gonna, <laughs> I'm gonna shove this in the corner here. This seems like a good spot on the ground. Speaking of ash, <laughs> I don't know if I should, I don't know if I should, it's, uh, we have, my grandpa's ashes are in our kitchen right now. My mother picked them up and uh, she's at the funeral home yesterday and and now we just they're just in our kitchen next to the sharp bins next to the biohazard containers like <laughs> I don't know what's going on in my house. I just like woke up and they were ashes. I was like ah yes my grandfather the biohazard. All right let's get everybody situated here with their their different needs. Uh, our poor little child bed uh and then yeah okay so they're all they're all headed headed to do those things so we'll get building okay okay so this is gonna be jimmy two feet's room i made jimmy two feet's favorite colors blue and purple i thought that would be fun uh because you know purple's kind of in between psyllium's color scheme that I did was blue and his mother is pink. Boop. So I thought we I could do something in between. What is there's like one are these objects new? Or <laughs> yeah. 
So uh, yeah, I thought I thought we could do that. So we'll start with some uh, bed stuff. So I have since uh, we played before I left, I purchased some packs that like kits for like kid stuff um, or a whole bunch of different build stuff. Look at the raccoon! Look at the raccoon on the top. That's so cute. <laughs> so they're supposed to be for like outdoors though. So you might see some new uh, build mode options. Uh, that's just from some a few kits that we have added. No gameplay stuff, uh, so I didn't bother, you know, not not including them. So my favorite set is this uh, this kid set. I also like the the pet set because that it's also got like a lot of really cute rounded stuff so we'll see uh what options we have in in both sets and on that look at this disco one or this oh this is cute <laughs> the little the little guy eating but this might be more the color scheme that i did for uh the rest of uh outfits little bit of that here <laughs> just in the corner awkwardly uh, so these particular sets have like matching yeah, matching matching stuff so I want to add those that's a fucking torture room what what is the like empty room <laughs> that's it, it, Oh yeah, uh, because we're gonna be building the bedroom. I I left this particular room empty because it's not something I like intended to do earlier. It's something that um, I needed to do after the end of last week. So I was like, we'll just um, don't worry. We will add plenty of plenty of decorations for little Jimmy. Uh, so it won't be so uh, terrifying. I think this clock is like huge. So we're gonna size it down. Maybe put it like here. This seems like a good spot for a clock. And we'll put maybe a little um, desk and stuff uh, over here. This is a good homework desk, but we'll put a computer on this one. Um, so we can go, the also have a matching desk set. One. Yeah. There's no dark, dark one with that. So move objects is on, which is why everything is like going and sliding through stuff. But I generally find I just turn it on and off and on and off and on and off so often when I build um, that it's better for me to just leave it on. And then if something doesn't work, I'll just move it later. <laughs> Good, this is cute. I like, I like my idea. So we also have the pastel pop set, which I don't think this matches, but um, it's got a lot of really cute stuff in it, so we might end up building with some of that stuff. So, um, let's do, oh no, let's do this chair. So it's like purple and blue and, and that, or even the dark blue one. No, it's not quite, it's kind of an indigo that we've got going on over here. So we'll just leave that one alone. All right. And there is, this is a little the closet, so we can do like a little dresser and maybe a as long as it isn't that plastic one. Which which one? The this this one or this this crazy looking cat one? There's actually quite a few ones in here that would be plastic. I chair. <laughs> This one looks like awful. <laughs> and this one, of course, 10 out of 10. Plastic swivel chair. It says that there's like four plastic swivel chairs. Hel helpful, Roscoe. <laughs> That one, uh, yeah. No, uh, I like this one. It looks like somewhere between like an actual like comfortable chair and like something that you would buy more cheaply, 
for a child. Like we already have one. We have a bowl. We have like a, a horde of them. <laughs> Turns out I really like this chair. Maybe we should do it in, in white then. Yeah. I'll stick your old office chair. Uh, we had one like this that was in like a dark, like dark blue that was really like, now it would be like really retro uh, that we had in the basement. And one time I made myself very, very sick, spinning it around in circles. <laughs> Which is information that you needed. Here's this beige. See, see beige is kind of hard as like, a seat because eventually it starts to wear down. And like you can see, like if you drop anything on it, you can see them e more easily. I was just gonna say you could see stuff on it. Okay, so these are here, but they're not open. That's good. Where am I going? What am I doing? I'm going here, here, here. I want these. I was going to storage and I couldn't remember what it was called. Uh, I can't remember- I couldn't remember if this came in like a short version as well or if it only came in like a tall version. Uh, it's like usually I use these not so much as to like just have a standing part but so that there's like something in this area because obviously we don't need one if we have a closet. I'm more- I'm more interested in like what it could look like. All right, let's put over here then. There we have a nice little mirror. Bad tall for a kiddo. Hmm, you never know. <laughs> here, let's go. Uh, let's go to storage. Ah, these. I was like, what is what is in storage? We got this little board. Like, sorry, pastel pop. I have not managed to find a place to use it yet. Um, but I can see some, uh, like, kids' room just absolutely thriving on all this nonsense. Um, where was I going? Here. You see Mr. Childson? Yes, Jimmy Two Feet, who is right over here, has just turned into a child. Hello, Jimmy Two Feet. Don't look so sad. Your grandfather just died in front of your eyes. It's fine. This giant-ass bookshelf. Let's do like a smaller bookshelf and then we could do a um seat. Well. Do like this. There we go. <laughs> Alright. Starting to get some stuff. Hello Russell, how are you doing today? surfaces has stuff huh I got the uh the basement kit so we have a lot of like fun little <laughs> storage stuff this is this is for me when I do building things um and also when I download other people's builds because they all use stuff that I don't have and then I have to replace it all and it drives me insane but also I've now got like a bunch of retro shit and it's super fun There we go. I'm trying to get rid of all the highlighted stuff telling me things are new. Like, I know. I know, I, bu I bought them. I was there. I got pissed off one night and I bought a whole bunch of stuff. <laughs> my frustration <laughs> led to the destruction of my, my credit card. It's fine. What do you think is missing? Oh, this, apparently. There we go, nothing is highlighted. There we are, all right. More of an impulse buyer. Honestly, most of this stuff, um, like, it was years before I purchased it, but I was trying to like download a bunch of lots and every time I, would download them it would tell me that I was missing content and I would try to go look for what was missing and it was like a whole bunch of stuff because I was refusing to purchase any of the kits um, but builders really love to use the kits so 
so there was just a ton of stuff missing and I was getting really frustrated. Uh, so I bought stuff that was missing from my favorite, my favorite one. So I bought all the build ones. So I don't have any of the, um, not from this purchase. I don't have any of the clothes ones. I might have some of the clothes ones from a gift. I can't remember. Okay, they're gonna sit on it this way. So we're gonna just put it, put the little pillows in here. They can sit here and read a book, you know? You impulse bought a Volkswagen MK7, a Volkswagen MK7 GTI. What? <laughs> that makes it sound like I'm <laughs> I'm reading a graphics card. <laughs> I'm sorry, that's why I'm laughing. Is this a car or a graphics card? Sarah can't tell. Um, all right, do we have an extra? No, we don't. Okay. Now, one of the questions is, do either of these have a swatch that fits into the room? That one does. All right, Draco, you're going in the you're going in the kids' room. <laughs> there you go. So that will sit next to the windows. Look cute. Go. Now we've got to kind of. No, we need the computer, and then we got to kind of like fill it out and make it look less terrible, terrifying. Look at this teeny tiny little computer tablet thing. Oh my god. It's like a little a little artist tablet. Oh, that's cute. I don't I don't know why it's so cute, but it's adorable. Okay. Come in other colors. They do. Okay, we're gonna get our sim a little. You know, I was gonna get them a laptop, but it looks really <laughs> it looks really small. So I'm not gonna do that. Um, that's what it's not the same. Just to be see, uh, just watch a centipede crawl to your laptop. Where's the setup? That's, that's all, you can't do that here in the game. Like the, the PC is like one of those all in one things and it's just in the monitor. There's a ton of stuff like this one should have a giant case, but it does not. It's about to be burnt because you're getting ready to edit. It. Oh my god. It's gonna be crispy. It's gonna be crispy. That's hilarious. Alright, so now we've got to like make it into their room. Uh I think a rug would be a good start because there's just a lot of open space in the middle. If we added a rug, it would look less kind of terrifying and empty. A lot of the rooms I made are huge, so hard for me to fill up the space. I'm not used to working with quite so much space. That's not really the right colors. It is like a good size though, and it's um a lot of fun color. Let's see if we can find one we like. That one's not bad. Right. Mm -hmm. All right, there's that option. We've got that. Let's sort by color. Blues and purples would be good. Really, you can't have a setup for gaming in, in a game? Nope, they don't let you buy towers. In a, <laughs> like, we can, uh, we can buy things that like, okay, <laughs> we could buy like headsets on like a stand as like a separate concept, but we can't buy like a, a whole, like, there's no like place to buy setups. Like it doesn't work, it doesn't work like that. Uh, also like something like this we could do. I do like the, uh, the bubble, the bubbly ones. I think they're a lot of fun. Um, I want to do like that. Yeah, I like that better. Then I'd also want to like change the walls. 
because uh, this is a little bit odd. You're confused today? Confused how your fiance randomly walked in wearing nothing but lunch, right? And asked me to explain the philosophy beside, behind the design of the moss tank. Was this a lead up or did she really want to know that? That looks too pillowy. You're going to take a break from Tears of the Kingdom? You need a break from the, the brilliance that is Tears of the Kingdom? Sounds like a lie. <laughs> How are you enjoying it so far? You're getting burnt. Oh, burnt out. That's fair. A little frog. Boss. Big like hoss. <laughs> Look at the frog. Frog. Okay. Geology is cool. It is cool. It's pretty. It's pretty cool. And now my brain is just frog over and over again. Also not a bad rug. I don't think it's quite right though. I love the dinosaurs. Excellent 10 out of 10 dinosaurs. Like I think one of the problems with this one is how close it is to the bed but not anything else. Maybe if I took away the thing underneath. Eh, 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 eh. eh. Hmm. I think the only ones that would really work are like giant dinosaur one and stuff. And I don't really know if I like those ones on this floor. Uh, let's keep looking, see if there's anything better. Suggested some that I've already tried. That's it. Nope. No, no, no. Nope. Deep, deep, deep. Fancy rug slit. I didn't know these came in like different patterns. Holy shit. Sorry, it's like a rug you could like make out of out of sections. Try a lit. Try a lit. Pardon, Nanny, what are you trying to say? I cannot dissect. Try a lighter taupe. I, I, like, if I was decorating maybe a, a adult's room, I think that might work, but I'm looking for something that's, like, bright and, and crazy looking because I'm going to paint the walls. Oh, for the wall. Okay, hang on. I'll show you what... Let's, let's get into the walls and see what I, what I'm talking about with this. So I, uh, I ha wasn't doing them yet because I just like didn't have a particular, I kind of had an idea what I was going to do, but I find that if I do them too early, we get like pigeonholed into something. No, oh, that's too dark. I like that one. Or there's like a bright ass purple. Oh! Bright ass purple might, you know, might be my falling. I like the blue, but I think something textured makes more sense. Um, for this spot. Darker stuff. Uh, not that one. I wish I had, like, the walls show the same trim as the rest of the house. I frankly cannot promise that. There are the trims, I don't know why, but you can't just, like, change them and they, they don't match. So it's, like, a lot. I kind of love the dinosaurs, I'm gonna be honest. The darker blue is great. Yeah, I like the darker blue, but I want something on it it feels too bare.
This makes this feel too bright uh, though, so I'm gonna try a different mat. I'm gonna do like really bright furniture. Go back to... Um, do, 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 do. Dinosaurs. Maybe, maybe it's some purple or like a, a light blue might work. See, okay, sometimes I get like into a particular design and I get really excited about it and then I realize that like it's not gonna work because they don't really have the options that I'm looking for. I mean, I have a lot of stuff now, but sometimes it's just still, like I can't put that just in the middle because it ends up too big or too small maybe. Here, let's try like, nope. Yeah, cause like I like that, but I would like it to Fill more. Maybe this is too. I might be thinking too hard. Anybody else getting that vibe <laughs> from me? <laughs> and okay, the clouds are really nice. I don't know if it's better. Oh my gosh, that's crazy. <laughs> it's so busy when it gets like that. Holy shit. Those bleed eyes. That's that's what we want. We don't we don't need eyes anymore. Removing them. For the sake of this. I feel like I've lost. I've lost my mind a little bit. I don't know what I'm doing anymore. And I'm like back here at like the original colors. <laughs> I wish this could be in between these two two sizes because it's a really nice color, um, and it matches the wall nice. And it, then it's just kind of I feel like it should be like out here, you know. I don't know. It's fine. Maybe it's fine like that. Maybe it's maybe it's good. I don't know. <laughs> they have any opinion? It's just me talking to myself, and you guys are like, "It's fine, Sarah." Let's look at one for while they're doing a straight line. <laughs> yeah, that one made my made my eyes bleed. I was like, "Oh boy, <laughs> that's a lot." Yeah, you know what? This is good. This is fine. And when they get older, we can put like a, a larger bed in the center. And I think that'll work well. Or we could even do that now with like this. Put a uh, kind of in the corner or just next to the thing like this. And then we'll, we can put a oop, something over here. We want chopper. Oh yes. Oh yes. <laughs> oh yes. That looks better. All right, and we can put stuff on the walls to make them look less blank. And uh, luckily for you, Roscoe, 
the uh, the trim is in fact the same. I ended up picking the same wallpaper but a different color. <laughs> All right, let's see if we can get some decorations in. Get to the lamps. This isn't lamps. This is lamps. You, uh, colors. Oh, this is cute. When did we get this? I bet it came with infants. Oh, look at the little guy. Look at this little guy. He's so sweet. There's just a little guy in the corner. I'm gonna make him uh, purple because the dinosaur is mostly that color. Oh, he's so cute. All right, and we need something over here as well. Not really. Lava lamp? Lava lamp. I don't know if it really matches the, the look. I do like the lava lamp though. There we go. Lava lamp. Get something a little bit more. Ooh, rocket ship. Excellent. I love all the different, like, stuff I have now. As <laughs> I didn't wasn't ever going to really buy any of this these packs, but the amount of, like, options I have when I'm building is so much nicer. Because we don't have a color wheel. Um, so it's just, it's just really nice to have those. Uh, all right. Um, decor. There's lots of um, you. Oh, we don't we don't need the color. Well, you know what? We could use the color. Let's start with the color. You're tired. Uh, why don't you take a nap, Roscoe? Or sleep? What time is it? It's morning, right? Nap time, Roscoe. <laughs> because you don't want to up. I mean, okay. <laughs> I can't make you. Don't take a nap because you don't. You don't want. This here. You. It's too early for a nap. But you said you're tired. <laughs> like there's a a retainer in a glass cup. I bet there's dentures. Yeah. <laughs> Ventures in a cup. I like it. Why am I, I okay, I'm gonna turn off these filters because there's a lot of uh a lot of stuff and it's just kind of blocking off some things. Dusty trinkets. It's a it's toothpaste. We can put toothpaste in the bathroom. Cool. Why does your toothpaste come in so many colors? Caffeine ah makes sleepy go away. It it does do that. It tends to. In my general experience, make the sleepy go away. So we're gonna get this stuff to all sit on the desk doing a fun little trick. I'm gonna pull it away. Then you arrange it from the top. Put it back and see how you did. I think I'd like this rocket ship to be a little bit this way. Oh. There we go. And we'll put the flowers further in the corner. Well, okay, a little further back. Like it's an old project or something, you know, from school. That's, that's as good as I can do. You'll be back, okay. So you're tea making. 
I would be here. Looking at the six million options I have to put on things because now I uh, have a problem. They gave me all this stuff that I have to uh, try to use it now because there's so much of it. Glowy skin care essentials. Good. The options. There are also, you know, different um, kids stuff that we've we already have. I kind of want them more like next to the We could put the post-it notepad Where? Hello? Post-it notes? I know you're in here. There you are. You can put that like here Posted notes do come in multiple colors, yes. There we go. There's some more stuff over there. Um, there's also like a little waste basket that has this kind of design on it um, that I'm gonna go ahead and, and put down. It's good. And let's get some wall stuff for sure. Oh, curtains will help a lot. In like the addition of, of stuff in this room. You, they're the the pet ones. I think we might find more options in the uh, these ones. Yes. I like that one a lot. I guess it doesn't really fit over this little baby one the way I would like it to. If we did them all in the this kind and then put them like the tall. God damn, why, why do you fit like this there, but like not like that for here? Oh, cause you, you can't be crossing in the middle, I see. They're all like up like this. That's fine. There, that'll give it a little bit, a little bit of something to take away. Land it is. I don't know if this is the poster set I want, but let's take a look at some options. There's like bands, boy critters, yes, okay. Wood critter purple, very popular with the kids. <laughs> this kid is supposed to be pretty young, but I'm just kind of making a bedroom that could be any age, uh, because I try not to, you know, do stuff that's gonna take up too much of my time going back and like redoing it. Um, but they're cute. There's also this cool little like board that, you know, it's like they painted those, um, but I don't even know what Jimmy Two Feet's like gonna be up to, so I guess we'll see. Room for, yeah, something like small on this wall would be good. Um, these are just kind of like cute. You know, there's like, when you're a kid, or at least when I was a kid, there's like a combination of stuff like I wanted on the walls and then like stuff my mom had put on the walls when she first designed the room. Um, and I feel like there's like an interesting mix between those two aesthetics in a kid's room. A lot of the time it's just like, mom definitely picked this out and oh, a kid definitely picked this out. <laughs> you know, like they, there's that. Uh, and I, I try, I'm trying to capture that vibe. 
<laughs> you know, they can get something, you know, nice on this wall. It's like, clearly, mom picked this out. And like, there are posters that obviously mom did not pick out here. <laughs> Right. I um, need something kind of longer to go on this wall. Um, can't be that though. One is too short. Two. Really match. There's definitely more like calendars and corkboard stuff. Um, but you know what? Let's put. Oh, let's put the. Oh my God, sorry. Let's put the dog over here. That looks good. I don't know. This doesn't really match, like, the look of the room. Like, the room is, like, friggin', like, space and nonsense, so... I think. Let, let me look. Let me figure this out. There are trees. <laughs> Not that that helps us, but there are trees. What about string lights? Where are these going? They only... String lights for ants. The string of lights is really low to ground. Maybe they're for ants. Maybe they're for ambiance. <laughs> oh, this is cute. Oh my gosh. Okay, hang on. Oh, they come in. They come in different colors. Okay. I think the uh color it's projecting isn't white. Yeah, there we go. Everything was turning like just a little bit. A little bit yellow. <laughs> right, it's not, it's not lined up. Hang on. There we go. They're all a little bit yellow, but I'll fix it. And that's so far away, but we can still put other stuff on the wall. I'm just like, this is definitely like within that kind of space disco theme that's happening. Yes, space disco. That's what we're calling this. You have waffles and tea? I would love some waffles. That sounds really good. I haven't had waffles in a while. I've had pancakes and French toast lately, but I have not had waffles. Definitely something for this wall. And I'm starting to think maybe this lamp doesn't work with it, but it's just, I don't know if I, I care. <laughs> oh. Um. And we also like, we have zero plants in here, so we could definitely add a plant uh, in the corner. Or there are also, okay, hang on. Let's do a couple of pack sort. There are like wall shelves and stuff that we can use. Um, if I can just, okay, so Parenthood's a good one, uh, for, like, different things for kids, rooms. I like Movie Hangout. There's also literally kids' room, and there's a toddler one. My First Pet's pretty good for it. And then we have all of this stuff, Little Campers, is a, this one, Pastel Pop. That, like everyday clutter we can use and I'm gonna turn on bathroom clutter to just maybe add a few things to the bathroom. Take a look through some of this stuff and see uh, if there's anything to put down. We have this silly little hamster eating a strawberry candy or whatever. Cute but I don't know. You can always put like
This definitely needs to be patterned if we're putting it down, because otherwise it looks a little boring, but I think it's, that makes it like a little bit too off theme. Yeah. Both of these little makeshift seating boxes. I don't know about those. We have some cute little tables. We have the stuff we've already used in here. Um, just kind of show you where I'm getting a lot of this stuff. It looks like it's made of uh, like clay. This la this goddamn window always likes to just vanish from existence. Where are you going? What are you gonna do when you get there? I don't understand. All right, let's do here. We can that there, a little space, space frame. Nice there, put something on there. Um, either that she earns over time or we can just grab something. Oh, we never gave her in the journal let's uh get one and we're gonna move the fox lamp a little bit kind of in our way oh no don't don't go back on there There we go. And then we can be like, aha, the journal's here. Cool. Totally clashing with the room. There we go. All right, and we've got some other stuff. We've got these crazy looking honeycomb shelves. I don't know if that really works. I mean, it's not like we need a lot of like play stuff because they have a playroom. Um, so we can just not that it'll hurt. You have one, so we don't have to put that stuff in, which is why. Oh, look at the tiny car! They turn the activity table into like a like a cardboard car thing. That's so cute. Oh my gosh. A fire pit for children. All right. Oh, and they have this like projector for movies now as well, which is. Oh yeah, there's this guitar thing. Really, plus carpet for kids. Yeah, it's in the little campers set, like the backyard for children set. I get why it's in that pack, but like my first thought was, ah, that's concerning. <laughs> Bushfire starter for kids. <laughs> exactly. Exactly. Amazing and terrifying. You see so many fires that your, your trees have adapted to survive the wildfires? What? <laughs> Is that a joke or like a real fact? I can't, I can't even tell. Um, when you can't tell if joke. Desert oak has thick bark to survive the temperatures of fire. That's pretty, that's pretty good of, of the, the oak. 10 out of 10. Good work. Doesn't even really look any good, so. Yeah, it doesn't look great over there. I don't know what to do with the space. And they release shine clubs of seeds that are exposed to fire temperature. Nice. It's the same with the desert grass trees produced, protected by a layer of dead leaves. 
Well, look at your environment just doing a good job. <laughs> this mirror has melted. I'm just like, I don't know what to put here anymore, so I'm just like trying random stuff. Like, you, you, want, you want part of the thing? Earlier, and after says Sarah, I try not to take naps. We've talked about this. I'm trying to take naps because then, then I can't get to sleep later. Sometimes it just happens, but <laughs> but I try. It's soap. Yes, thank you. It is soap. I noticed. Scenes, what looks like drugs. Like fake, fake toy box. Toy box you, you can't use. At least you can use this one. Bathroom clutter. I mean, yeah, that's, that's what that is. I don't really like the comb because they're like crossed over each other. It feels very deliberate. <laughs> so I don't like them. <laughs> New shoes. Okay, see so this is the only this is the only thing Draco you can buy. It's like a peripheral like we can buy okay, you can buy this now. But like a regular peripheral, you can buy you can buy a headset. <laughs> Dude, child is too young for all this. No one's too young for a phone, but maybe keys. <laughs> maybe too young for keys. Oh, there are these skateboards. Is there a set of skateboards that I think would <laughs> The alien. <laughs> ah, yes. Tentacles in my child's room. It seems right. You know what I think we should do? We should hang the lights like this. Very well. <laughs> like they're attached to this thing. And then they just stop back there. And then we can bring it up a little bit and do that. Oh, no, we're gonna have to drag. What's wrong with children being? <laughs> wrong with being children being introduced to tentacles early? <laughs> nothing. Do I enjoy so bad it's good games? Um, not like as a rule. Oh man, they added friggin' light switches. Everybody lost their mind. There's also plugs. Everybody lost their minds. 
I haven't put them anywhere. Here. <laughs> hey, Fox! <laughs> How are you? The calamari. like this you just have to change them so they're the right color you heard tentacles and you felt some <laughs> uh well it wasn't it wasn't on purpose but uh well well prop this up higher Now it's like on par with the other ones. This is gonna be like a display shelf. We can put something right there. I feel like now that I've like gone through all this stuff, there's just not enough on her head. Sorry, the dresser. No, we don't need the kids bop CD set. The dresser or the side table. It's not a dresser. There's they could have a duck. <laughs> I want a duck on the side table. Thank you for the hydrate. Just to drive by saying hi, I got to go to the other side of the country tomorrow because your stupid brother had offspring. Um <laughs> well I hope you enjoy meeting your uh, nephew or niece. back a little bit so the journal has a little bit more room to weave. Look at this old phone, yes. And a lunchbox, that's so good. Just very much enjoying a lot of the little additions from the clutter kits. We're gonna get food. I wouldn't want to have played the U Testament. I don't know what that is, Kindle. So I don't know. So, okay, I like that they added like, you know, oh, kids are messy, here's a messy thing. But like, wouldn't it make more sense to like cut this up into four pieces and let you put them in different spots around the room instead of just being like, yeah, it's, uh, it's messy, but just like just there. <laughs> that feels like <laughs> confusing <laughs> to, to do that. Like, okay, just the one spot though. Um, I wanna see some plants now. Ooh, backpack, that's a good idea. Blue that next to the door. Don't forget your backpack, Jimmy. The game where you play as a person during biblical times, okay? What happened? You get stoned to death? I guess you could do that now. Some places. Play as a one, a one, what? One foot woman? Just a one footed or like one foot tall? <laughs> I assume you mean one foot tall because of the way you wrote it, but <laughs> for some reason it surprised me a lot. And beat up Jesus until he threatens to kill you. Uh, interesting. Yeah, no, not, not really my thing there. 
<laughs> of a thing. <laughs> That's so random. It's a woman with tall person. Woman who tries to beat up Jesus. this drawer I don't want to like interfere <laughs> so we're gonna I'm gonna move that away ah darn yes it just kind of gets in the way if it's taller all right fine backpack stays my pick stays over here. <laughs> there. The only two plants in the in the room. And we could instead just put this here and put the backpack next to the mirror. That would make a little bit more sense. as like random plant placement goes. I think this is a pretty good bedroom. I mean, I'm still not sure about this bit. I feel like there should be something more interesting on this wall. Um, but I couldn't really find anything I liked. So I guess I'm leaving it like this. Um, I think in general, it's a pretty good, it's a pretty good room. Let's save it here. Let Jimmy Two Feet explore this blue and purple, blue and purple room. Probably sleep because I I think Jimmy Two Feet is very tired. Jimmy Two Feet is very tired. All right, go get go get some rest, funny friend. All right, so today we need to make sure that our that di our diabetes the diabetes has. Uh, finish what she does, she's doing. The biggest problem with this one is how is she supposed to get in an angry mood when she's got like a plus five sad emotion? So I'm gonna do the usual thing we do with our Sims when they're sad and I need them to longer be sad and uh, get them, I'm not gonna donate that to a fan, no. Uh, I'm going, <gasps> Kayla, hello! I'm just gonna, I'm buying my Sim face mask because that's how I fix problems in this game. Let's just buy a whole fuck ton. There you go. All right. And then I think something we can do is check the crystals and see if any of them uh, help take away sadness. Charges bladder, hygiene, social. Here's the mind of uncomfortable energies. That's not quite right. Hunger and skills. Clears a uh, Sim's mind of sad energies. Orange topaz it is. Whatever crystals in that. Um, this one, I think, it, yeah, it recharges all needs except hunger. But we're gonna mount our orange topaz. And then we're going to wear our stupid crown. Clears a sim's mind of all sad energies. What if you take it off? Okay, she's embarrassed from what she was wearing for four hours, but she's no longer sad about her father's death? Holy shit. All right, everybody put the crown on. How am I? I'm doing really good. How are you? Oh, right, I forgot his emotion quirk is that he he's listening to- The Grim Reaper is your fan? Hang on. Um, make the Grim Reaper swoon. I put the wrong thing in his inventory. I've replaced that. In the world, so he can have one. 
um, as well. Thanks for, for putting that down. Did the Grim Reaper not care? Did he not swoon? Oh, apparently he did, but he just didn't pass out. Can, can we not sign? Oh, we can. Okay, uh, totally. We can sign an autograph. You're doing better? I'm glad to hear that. Hang on, we're signing our autograph for the Grim Reaper. Um, it's like, we're super famous, so... And we're... Removing everybody's sad energies. Crystal. Does this not have a crystal in it? have any crystals oh her orange topaz came out when she took the crown off okay hang on we're gonna mount the mount so look, okay i discovered if you mount orange topaz into the crystal it takes away your fucking sad buffs so they just um they just witnessed the death of their father and i'm just clearing the sad buffs with this fucking crown that's nonsense also, 10 out of 10, recognized by the Grim Reaper. He knows. He knows. Okay, we're gonna go practice our comedy. Uh, you saw your sister today. It's rather I made ground with her. That's really good. I'm glad. I'm glad things are, are better for you, Kayla. I, it was really sad to hear uh, that that stuff was happening. I'm not gonna like go all over it for chat again. <laughs> so we're gonna call it that stuff, but um, yeah, so I was, I felt pretty bad for you, so, uh, I mean, even just little things, you know, are going better. So he's no longer worried about, uh, his father passing away. Um, so I'm gonna have him put the phone down on the floor. We're gonna give, uh, we're gonna pass this along to Peanut Butter, who is also pretty upset. Yeah, and give her back her thing. Yeah, he's not, he's only got 41 minutes of sadness left, so I'm just gonna go have him. Still a pep talk. Peanut Butter's gonna go, gonna go fix his mood. I don't know why she's not upset. She's just like, really still happy from her enemy dying. But you know. It'll only hold you for so long, girl. She's really tired, she needs a nap. All right, we're gonna send, oh, right, she lives upstairs now. Send her to nap. All right, he's got, he's got the crown. So first we're going to slot an orange topaz, and then we're gonna have him wear the crown. You're gonna have to take off your thing. Look, look, fucking four days of, of, of sadness, just gone. Just vanished in front of our eyes. All right, out of context. If Slim takes a public figure statement, just a little bit out of context, he'll have to get a great calm out of it. Even though he knows it's a stretch, he can either run with it and hope the readers agree with him or wait and hope something newsworthy comes along. I think that sounds like a very rude thing to do. So we're gonna wait and hope. We lost some performance, but you know what? I feel, I feel good about it. I feel better. All right, See, he's just, his status is gone. It's like, how many days are these buffs? Two days of, and he witnessed it too, so he would have been like plus five. It's just gone. He's just not sad anymore. Yeah, there you go. And we just put it back on the ground. Give the crystal back to the diabetes, and she's good. We're all fine. Everybody's good. And they're just embarrassed a little bit for four hours. Like, that is such a huge difference I'm going to just I'm gonna just have him I forgot his name was Lawrence Fishborn I'm gonna have him uh I don't know you want to go play some video games for a little bit gonna take a nap just practicing her comedy develop your comedy skills perform interactions that increase your comedy I mean this should be doing it but it doesn't doesn't seem very excited about it. He's also got some other resolution due. Oh, well, shit. I was trying to get him a girlfriend, but I got distracted. The mother plant. Um. Oh well. All right. Instead, we're gonna come over here and we're gonna perform some miss funny interactions with her brother. 
Um, hopefully that'll... Oh, no, we don't have a gift to give him. Let's not do that. Uh... <laughs> he's crying because he's... He's not gonna have a girlfriend in time. Stop that. He's having an emotional meltdown. Boy. I'll get you a girlfriend. Relax. Yeah, okay, she's feeling a lot more sad now. Um... He's a widow. I'm gonna have her be able to get this crown, actually. So I'm gonna get her up and... Uh, put that in her inventory. Well, that should help Pearl if, uh, if we have this on. So we're gonna mount that orange topaz and then wear the wear the crown. There we go. So yep, now she's uh, feeling a lot better. Oh, you also had a resolution. Complete an aspiration milestone. Oh, sorry. I thought, I thought it would happen earlier, but it didn't. Alright, and we'll just place that in the world. There you go. My big question is, can children wear, wear this or not? We're gonna send her back to her little nap, because I did not get to finish that. Well, leveled up the comedy skill, and developing it has finished. She's feeling pretty playful now. Um, we'll just get Sasuke to produce a track real quick. And uh, let's check if he has any videos in the video inventory that he's working on. Oh, he is? Oh, he just has to upload it. That works. Remix the track. Oh, <laughs> Salim, I didn't even know you had a celebrity level. I'm gonna be honest. I think he got it from, from books. Gnomester's Paradise is a fantastic name. For a, uh, for a track. Poor dummy. So tired. All right, you can get up now, little kid. It's fine. So I want to see if uh, the crystal crown can be given to children or not. If not. Six minutes. He still has another vacation day. Um, because I have been wanting to do stuff with him, but maybe he should go to work and we can uh in Oh, you know what? No, because I need to take him out to make more vaccines. To make more vaccines, then we can fight the mother plant more efficiently. Cause last time we didn't do a very good job. Um, let's do business, take a vacation day, and we'll have him sleep. Um, we're gonna see if we can get this, uh, child to wear the crown. Or if it won't work. Cause, uh, they are, like, Jimmy is in a really bad mood. And if it doesn't work, we'll just give Jimmy, like, every single... <laughs> Research the anger emotion for me. All right, go try to... No, don't make a silly face. Uh... Try to calm down. There we go. All right, Jimmy. Put that in your inventory and see if you can wear it. You can! Okay, cool. Children can wear the, uh, the crystal crown. So let's mount that orange topaz and put that on. Look at that! And nobody cares that <laughs> the Chungus died anymore. <laughs> Amazing. All right, let's have him. Oh, no! Get some cake. Get some cake, kiddo. All right, she is successfully angry um, because she's, you know, brought out the rage within. But she was calming herself down, so we're gonna have to do uh, we're gonna have to do it again. I think it's just sight cheers, make fan spoon, pose for pictures, cry and demand. All right, can you uh you research your anger emotions, spring it out, 
be angry, be upset at the world. Let's go find someone to yell at. Um, hello, people, any humans in the area? I mean, like vampires, blue too. Aliens? Mermaid somehow in the game? Aha, male person. So rudely introduce ourselves to that random male person. Actually, you know what? Let's just be mean to the butler. They're right here. Uh, sorry, butler. I'm gonna insult your face. <laughs> the butler is so sad from the death earlier. I'm sorry. I I have to do this for my for my job. Oh, he's in such a bad mood. All right, you uh, only sent that video out. We can uh, reply to our comments. And we can release a new a new track, and that should give him what he needs for today. All right, are you finished researching that emotion? You are awesome. Okay, we're going to. Um, how do I apologize profusely? Try to yeah, smooth apology. I am. I am so fucking sorry. Are we mind controlling him, girl? What was that? Incite cheers. I want to see her do these on Butler. Or someone of someone. I heard the passing of someone special to you. I want to offer my condolences. I'm so sorry. She doesn't, she doesn't like me. So she's currently supposed to be inciting cheers from surrounding people, but he does not give a single fuck. Amazing. <laughs> All right, Butler, could you like, oh, I was gonna ask you to cook a meal. He just does not care about her at all. That's totally fair. All right, he did, uh, did what I asked him to do. I don't know what else I'm gonna do today. Just... Right, okay, he's supposed to like be also learning instruments and stuff, which I like never. Um, we'll go do that. Just clear out this like cake and, and things. Come on, everyone. Sugar cookies, cake, bread sticks. You guys want all this stuff, right? What's my child up to? Need some social. Here, clean up the plate. Cause that'll help with uh, your, your stuff. And you also need, I need you to sign up for scouts. That's the other thing that kids need to do. Um, no, please don't adopt anything. Play game. For delivery. Join an after school activity. Okay, there we go. I know your resolution is due here. Get some food. The brownies. You can, you can have brownies. So, uh, something that came with the Get Famous expanded pack is that you can now join grandma drama club as a kid and they can learn to act. But because uh, we aren't going to be doing any of that stuff with Jimmy Two Feet when they grow up, we're just going to do scouts to highly, highly improve uh, the rate at which they gain skills. Um, how about you talk to your grandmother? Uh, controversial opinions. Brownies are awful? Really? Frittata, good job, Abraham. You actually made a meal that people can like act, like enjoy That's in our household. That's pretty pretty intense, there, bud. Dreams, cool, and toys, and whatever else children talk about. All right, we're gonna have him come downstairs. And... Why don't you uh, like brownies? I mean. Probably because they don't taste good to you. But what is it about them? Because they're they're chocolate, they're sugary. I like these things. Brownies are there. And here you go with your uh paid the existence of, of vampires with your grandma. Or like the burnt bottom of a muffin. I feel like you've not had very good brownies. 
because that is like not at all my experience with brownies. There are some pretty bad brownies out there, but I think we're hugging twice in a row. Oh, hey, Selim, you're back. How was work? He's upset because he lost his little fame star. Um, to keep stuff like that, you have to like keep up with your, your social media stuff. Um, and he hasn't really. Lol, did you really leak your number on the net? Ha, just another dumb celeb. How rude. He is so stressed out. Hair, do you want one of these six million things I gave you? Fly a relaxing face mask and, and go eat like a cookie. That'll, that'll fix you. Fix you right up. All right, how are you doing? You get some food? So I want to take him uh, out to... Um, where are we going all those stairs? I want to take him out to Strangerville again so he can... John over there. Play the piano. Well, okay, then go play the piano. Follow your heart. You're, you're, you need a pee. Here, I want you to set the table again so that people can use that next time. And, uh, your homework. We already have one of these boards upstairs, but thank you for that. Salim looks great. 10 out of 10. Good luck for you, bud. What's he want to do? Watch a movie? Sure. Why not? Watch Sims of the Dead! Right. You do that. If you could come help your child with their homework, that would be much appreciated. Where is Diabetes? Okay. <laughs> Show me the ground. It was like, where is she? Where is she? Is she dying? Here, why don't you come watch, like, join him in watching this movie because you have a, a social need you need to fill. Here, discuss color theory and why do you have to get up to do that? You know what? I'm not even going to question it. You just, you follow your heart. They don't know each other super well. That's fine. We can compliment his outfit and... No complaints. Heartfelt, we can flatter him and be like, you are great. This is great, great AI going on here. Right, she's helping with the, the homeworks. So that's going well. Perfect. Good job, kiddo. You're gonna be, you're gonna be a superstar. All right. Then uh, I am actually going to get this out and I'm going to have him uh, pack it into a lunch. Incredibly random, but yes, pack it into a lunch. And then I'm going to have him take it with him. All right, Jimmy Toofy finished his homework. Mom helps. Everyone's getting tired. Salim is just, you know, just chilling. Why don't you take that face mask up off before I go so it's not like a, a problem? Was the movie bad? Oh, the movie was boring. Sorry to hear that. Yeah, all right. Every everyone has gotten you know stuff done today. Been busy on this. Needs to level up once. But I'm good. I'm good with where we are. And uh, we'll go to Strangerville tonight and we'll come back uh, tomorrow to go through Diabetes' little movie thing that she has. Look at our little family. They're so cute. I like... <laughs> incredibly proud of all of how far the legacy has come my brain is like oh they're beautiful they're lovely they're mine i did such a great job
Hello. Let's uh, use our key card and get our hazmat suit on. I don't think we need it for this bit. All right, we need spore clusters. Cool, all right, scan. Scan for your spore clusters a whole bunch and then we'll collect them. Asked him to scan more, but apparently he canceled it when I asked him to open it. We're gonna need a, a whole bunch of this stuff, so if it's... All right, unpack your lunch. It's time to it's time to randomly eat lunch in this area. You need to be caring for yourself. It's bored now because of that movie. All right, Pearl has work soon. If you could eat, that would be awesome. Yeah, he's just gonna he's just gonna chow down real quick. Oh, he's got a cute little buff. Shame they keep dying in spontaneous fires. <laughs> My sis, yeah, yeah. Packed with love. You packed it for yourself, bro, but okay. Oh, he can, he can pick them up while he's eating. <laughs> good, you're in a good, you're in great mood. Okay, that only spawns four, so we need at least, no, 15 is three. We still need more, though. So. I think like five vaccines should be good. I don't know, I've never done this before. That's four. Peanut butter earned a thousand dollars for standing down here and doing nothing. Good work. Okay, now we're gonna mix some vaccines. Um, avoid children for six hours. Look, we're gonna do that, so here you go. This is so funny to me. Like, hello. We're just gonna hang out in this lab and like make stuff. Made an infection vaccine. Okay, cool. Reached logic level six. You you are just pump. He's just pumping up the logic skill by just being doing this like quest because he has he's had to make so much vaccines. Up. See, like he stayed away from children. He wants to be mean to a child. I mean, you can do that. You have a nephew. Be nice and easy. All right, two more. Adoption notice. Ah, oh, okay. Yeah, someone adopted a child in the in the neighborhood. Did he fail the last one? Oh no, I'm just dumb. Okay. All right. Last one, friend. Getting tired. I mean, it is 4 a.m., so that's incredibly fair. What time does she have? 9 a.m.? Okay, we'll head back soon and get her ready for work. But now that he's got all of these, the next time he comes uh, to Strangerville, we should be able to get, should be able to, to kick mommy plant ass. Um, of which I am a bit sad, because I wish you could do something else, because mommy plant, Mommy plant grants wishes. Hang on, speaking of mommy plant granting wishes. Should we uh, run downstairs and go get, go get wishes from mommy plant? We're gonna be close on time with diabetes, but. Can't remember if we damaged our relationships with her too much. Request gifts. Riches, energy. So I want to try life extension. Hi, mommy. So he has nine days until he ages up right now. And because I tried to murder mommy plant, do you think mommy plant will be rude about this? This is going to be really weird if someone wasn't here last week, huh? Oh my gosh, it reset his aging. Holy shit. We are youthful now. Yeah, well, get everything you can out of out of mommy plant. I 
missed Kindle. I missed you saying you're beautiful and lovely, Kindle. <laughs> Thank you. I only got. I only noticed the shame they keep dying in spontaneous fire. <laughs> Just because you had already typed, so I was like looking for a new color. You should not have come here. You cannot stop me. I mean, I, I I'm sure I can. Mommy Planet. The problem is really that I don't want to stop. I mean, it's great, can't we just leave it like this? We'll just give everyone hazmat suits and it'll be fine. All right, I'm gonna just have him come inside and he can take care of his own self. <laughs> Why are you guys in Peanut Butter's room? Um, you've acquired the logic skill? Men what? How? You're a child. You shouldn't be able to acquire the logic skill until you're at least finished with the mental skill. All right, you get off his computer. I'm gonna lock. Lock computer for everyone but peanut butter. Hopefully that'll be that'll be good. Uh, he's in a good mood. She's doing great. How is how are you, kiddo? You don't he doesn't have school for a while. Um he should be good. I'm glad you're learning stuff. He wants to play on the jungle gym while in a playful mood. Does this count as a jungle gym or do you have to be like at the park? Where why are you so focused? Oh, because you were in Peanut Butter's room. Peanut Butter's room is a is a focused area. He doesn't write for three days. Damn. Alright. Well, come down here. Sorry, he doesn't go to the mommy plant. I forgot we uh I did that. Here, come here. Come sit. You go pee and then like go to sleep or something. I don't, you are in like a really bad mood and you're kind of refusing. Lock for everyone but peanut butter and then we'll allow access to the butler so they'll stop running in there. Um, I feel like he'd be pretty private about his room. How you doing kiddo? I should take a bubble, oh. <laughs> The butler walked in on you. You know what would help? If the sink wasn't broken. Well, you don't really have anything to do today. It is raining outside, though. Why don't you play some, uh... Why don't you chat with some other children on the internet? I hate how it does it. Go sit. Everyone, but should be two feet. And then you can chat from there. And you can write your book. And we can see how she's doing. All right. She's still infected, by the way. We should probably make a vaccine specifically for her. Um, and we'll have her come take a nice soak bath, honey, milk, and oatmeal bath or work. Sounds good. She's apparently in there with her clothes. Your 15 minutes of fame are rapidly coming to an end. TikTok diabetes. Wow. How rude. Not let that get to us. They're jealous. They're jealous of our, our fame. We are the amazing diabetes after all. It makes sense that someone would be jealous of us. Yeah, apparently our mother just took care of herself. Oh, look at little Jimmy two, <laughs> two feet just sitting here, <laughs> getting there, getting their chats in. I think it's so cute. I don't, I don't know why I think everything's so adorable all the time, but here, I don't know how I got over there. <laughs> the social level four already, damn. All right, time to go. Join. I'm naturally drawn to fire. Mm-hmm. Like a, like a moth. And then I burn to a little crisp. I'm drawn, I'm drawn to the torchic. Everybody's outside? Oh god, what have you done, diabetes? You know what, I know what you're gonna do though. Pose for pictures. You guys wanna take a few snaps, hmm? Yep, take those selfies. 
I'm just very excited that I'm here. Post a Sims Instagram story. We can do that. <laughs> but lots, Neiman, welcome in. How are you? No. Yeah, welcome to me uh, disrupting the workday by being shiny. <laughs> what is this? is this? There's an alien person. I think it's like a oh. sea monster space. I don't know. I can't remember what we're doing. Today, I wasn't paying attention. Okay, compliment us in on set. Let's go inside. Um, let's check out what it, this is called. The, oh, right, the sheriff from <laughs> Alpha Century. I thought it was funny because it was like a space cowboys. I think so. Or just normal cowboys, but I'm gonna guess space cowboys. Compliment just any sim on set. Um, I haven't met the director. So let's try that. We're already feeling pretty great because uh, we like attracted a ton of random attention. Go talk to them. Royalty reports, of course, very famous. Uh, okay. Yeah, say greet the new director. We constantly, they're constantly changing directors. So we're constantly having Let's do you compliment their outfit. Oh my god, your your game pick director's outfit absolutely slays. You're doing fantastic. I'm living for that beret. Stop spinning and freaking out and just say hi. There you go. Jesus Christ. Practice acting. I, I pretty much do this all the time, but okay. Let's go, Diabetes. Yeah, it's like some sort of space bounty hunter cowboy stuff. I don't know what's going on, but I like it. <laughs> Maybe we're the cowboy. We're the sheriff. The sheriff from Alpha Century. I think it's supposed to be maybe a Mandalorian joke. I'm not sure. It might have been before that. Get notes from our director. Oh my goodness, okay. Come on, diabetes, we gotta hurry up. Cool. Tell the director we're ready, but we're not in hair and makeup. I mean, I know that they don't necessarily need us to be if it's not one of the things, but if it's they're highlighted like they normally are, so I feel like we we should need to be in hair and makeup. Yeah, we do have we are the sheriff first of all, ten out of ten. This is a great look. Uh, but second of all, we did have an outfit. The game just did not direct us to do it this time. We're gonna tell the director we're ready. I'm glad I did that because I love this look. Oh my goodness. We're gonna turn off her fame shine just for um. For this, because I'm probably gonna take a picture of her and it'll get in the way. I was like, what's that on her arm? But it's her diabetes is di diabetes sensor. Definitely dress for the occasion. Yes. 10 out of 10 sheriff outfit. This is like if I was trying to be a sheriff. Just like titties out. <laughs> Not historically accurate. 10 out of 10. I love it. All right, let's go do these different things. But hi, Velocity, by the way. How are you? I ask everyone how they're doing every day. That's a very important question to me. Um, and also, how'd you find me? I like, very interested to know how different people find my channel. Just looking for some stuff, cause we are just doing, uh, we're playing with both StrangerVille and the Get Famous. Uh, packs. Oh, we have our <laughs> our space aqua creature. Yeah. Okay. So the risky stuff should work because we finished all our prep tasks. <laughs> You're doing well, hum. I doing. Oh, she maxed it out. Please, special gold jacket and pants. 
Sweet. I'm doing awesome. I'm having a very good day. You just found some page and looked interesting? Well, welcome. We are doing a legacy challenge. This is a uh, generation like six or seven. Um, uh, what I've been doing is it's a little bit different than the usual legacy challenge rules in which every time we get to a new generation, I add the next expansion pack that was released and then every like other DLC like stuff packs or game packs that were released between the last one and the one we're adding. So with each generation, we get to kind of like deep dive and explore the different packs that have been released because I found that over time, I just didn't really, I would buy the packs because I wanted the content, but I didn't really explore each pack and like understand everything that it could do. So I was, I'd be playing and I'm like, wait, this can, this can happen. What is happening? Like why? I didn't know this was a possibility. And I, you know, I really want to see all the different stuff that actually has to offer. I bothered to pay for it. Um, so we've been doing that. So yeah, this is pretty far into uh, the generations, but our, our family tree will not reflect that because I accidentally lost the saves and had to remake everything, but it's okay because they're on YouTube. So I just followed everything and remade them. <laughs> Don't worry about it. Nobody worry about it. Hang on, 10 out of 10 guitar, guitar playing in this outfit. Here, get that thing out of your face. There you go. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Diabetes playing guitar. Put that as a, like a wallpaper. I didn't know you could play guitar. <laughs> I didn't ask her to learn or anything. <laughs> Velocity is a skindle. I feel like I should like warn you or something. <laughs> you do not work. We have not been at work in a while. Oh, he's not having any fun. Oops. Enjoy yourself. All right, we've got the Risky Fire Sim Ray. All right, you gotta go against Space Bounty Hunter now. Sheriff. Sheriff Diabetes. <laughs> yes, Kindle's our live bot. Uh, Kindle posts in the uh, Discord for me that I have live because uh, our regular bot was getting like two hours late. Uh, so we we gave uh, gave him a nice promotion. All right, and we're gonna beat this person up apparently. Go go get him, get him diabetes. I like how we're already like very much gold. Like just just do it, just do this. Yep. And now we've got to lock them up. The true the true cul culprit. Oh, it's on this. <laughs> Are we, are we gonna do it from inside here? Are you locked up? Are they locked up? Wait, the cameras are rolling, Diabetes. Stop, get off Twitter. <laughs> what are you doing? Yeah, go in the jail cell. I have no idea what's happening in this show. Or movie. I don't know what this is. We need to play the proud Sheriff Reynolds. Tiny on Alpha, I'm sorry, Sheriff Reynolds is outlaws to deal with. Okay. Apparently I, I have a posse, but I don't see any posses. This doesn't tell me if it's a movie or if it's, if it's a, uh, <laughs> if it's just a TV show. Cause it says like, okay. Cause there's parts of this, not the word star, sorry, that want you to uh, earn a gold in a movie acting gig, but I don't know. That's that's only a great witch play. I've not heard of Legacy Challenge enough. Ah, yeah. So it's basically just you play. So you're supposed to play like ten generations of people, and you set. There's a standard rule set like the firstborn of every generation takes over the next generation. Uh, <laughs> so we're basically playing with that. But you can add more or less rules, and the idea is to, to count points, but that's not really what I'm doing. I just added it to kind of give us some structure to play with. Do, do, do. 
So we have to play on the same lot forever and, and we just keep keep going forever. That's why we're very rich. Because <laughs> it's been a while. We are now a superstar. What's higher than superstar? Silver screen icon is apparently higher than the superstar. She's tired now. Well, go take a nap. Go nap. Diabetes nappy. This is the house. I was showing people earlier at the beginning of the stream, I did some uh, new rooms uh, for people because I've been procrastinating doing them. And uh, we made this uh, cute little kid's bedroom. Welcome back, Draco. Thank you for the sub. And Jimmy Two Feet is back from scouting. Hello, Jimmy Two Feet. Uh, we're going to go back to Strangerville with him with once he gets home in like the middle of the night. <laughs> but if you could take care of yourself a little bit, that would be good. Here, just like. But job experience, just have a good time. He's constantly, for some reason, that sim in particular, it's always in work hard mode and it's not what you need. And it makes him very tense, but it does not increase his performance. I don't know what's wrong with it, <laughs> but it's annoying. Here, let's, uh... oh, you have, a, you have a badge you can collect already. Nice work, kiddo. Let's, um, Play. Oh, I was gonna say play arithmetic attack, but also practicing typing. I think is good. Thank you for the follow, Velocity. Okay, how's everyone doing? You need food. Anna, come get some. Come get some sugar cookies. Trying to clear out the baked goods. Oh, this isn't your bathroom anymore. <laughs> and then take a shower. So we're promoted to Griffin Scout. <laughs> That was a little bit late. Thank you for the party parrot break. We have to stretch a little bit. <laughs> Let's get Salim uh Take care of himself a little. No, not a steamy shower. I need you to do other things. Oh, this is not where you where you take care of yourself anymore. Um, and then you can come back over here and write book. Do that for various things. The little men's festivals in town. I don't really care. He doesn't have work for two days, so I guess he'll just work on his writing. How are you doing? You need to pee. All right, he needs to shower too, but I uh, asked grand the grandmother Pearl to go shower in that thing. The dead. Okay, <laughs> wait, hide in the closet. Peanut butter has a major deadline approaching, and needs to find a way to knock it out. So it's just asking me if I should be responsible or not. Yep, good job. Performance gain, ten out of ten. All right, his fun is up, so I'm gonna have him. Socialize with his co-workers because his social is down. Um, we're not really losing that much performance from this, so it's fine. He is really hungry. I wish he would eat. Like, are you afraid of it? Why, <laughs> why aren't you eating? All right, you need to have a good time. Why don't you build some, some blocks? I can't remember what this helps with, but yeah, just have a good time. Build shit. Enjoy yourself. Legos. Oh. Canad. Nothing happened. You saw nothing. And as per usual, let's just get him to produce a random track and then uh, send that away and then he can start working on his like classical music decisions. Um, I am to go out somewhere. No, we're not going, we're not going to, to the romance festival because I, you think my grandma has a secret admirer a breadstick you're doing good you just woke up from a nap besides the fact that you really need to pee you're doing good <laughs> how is her celebrity stuff going but she is almost to five stars um if we just like buy some random stuff um she can get to five stars 
dumb sentence I've heard from my squadron mates. What if we take an F-18 up to its service ceiling and then dive with full afterburners? Is that like go very fast straight down? Is that, is that what that means? Like in in regular people terms? Here we go, give rockets to people. What happened is a plane would reach a speed so high it would rip apart. Yeah, that sounds like a bad plan. I would also not say to do that. Really tired. His empathy is so low, oh my god. What did I do to you, child? I mean, he's evil. The problem is he's evil. Diabetes, you represent the peak of human ability and the skill of pretending. This seems to be the best a human can do. Nevertheless, the steady accrual of data and simoleons from our investment in US proved worthwhile. This relationship shall continue for now. Forward note from studio name, Diabetes, your performance was jaw-dropping. Congratulations. Thanks, uh, AI. The dude in a beard. And uh, that is pretty, like, stereotypical. It's like, what would happen if, like, we were to dive the play like, a full speed, but, like, straight? <laughs> okay, I want, I want her to, to see how much it would gain in level. That's, that was a significant amount of, of fame gained for level five. Oh my god, is this really diabetes? You're, like, so hot. <laughs> They're typical 18 year old Air Force recruit. Can we dive the plane straight at the ground? The answer is if you want to die, yes. All right, let's see if we can get her a gig. So we bypass all of the additions for gigs, which is very helpful. Um, let's see. Oh, we haven't done either of these. Okay, so we can either do like a. The Tournament of Honor. We haven't done, like, a... This is Captain Sigma Olympic landing, looking for a strong, commanding lead to play the iconic Captain Sigma. When evil creeps into the light with nefarious intentions, it is up to Captain Sigma to save the day. With the iconic photo blade, Captain Sigma uses superior strength and superior intelligence to handle all the challenges a supervillain can come up with. That sounds like fun. We'll do that. Uh, and she has that. 9 a.m. Tuesday, and she's supposed to research being angry again, develop fitness, and develop friendship with her co-star. All right, well, we will go do a no sweat. Yeah, uh, that didn't really throw me off because, um, Canada, but... And I know you're not from the U.S., but you know, you know, you work in three hours. I have just not been working on her career and stuff like at all. I <laughs> ignore it. Just have more breadsticks. Just just more breadsticks. That's really what you need here. Additional breadsticks. Oh, this guy has been up here doing this for like hours. Whoops. Yeah. <laughs> for some reason it wasn't going off. Okay. And bird that track. Yes, and release the track. Yes, good work. Good work, kiddo. But yeah, I'm not really interested in like getting everybody to full fame or anything. Just having one sim at full fame seems like enough for me. Uh, he just finished his book. Hell yeah, okay. You'd be high in the squadron because it means you get to have a desk. The real reasons to do something. Why is this here? I realized this was here earlier when the was burning down, but I don't remember putting it there. All right, he's going to put this down and then um, I'm gonna make a copy of our books. I like to do that. And then we take the copy, put it away, put this in our inventory. And where are you exactly? Oh, there's paparazzi inside our house. Oh my god. Diabetes, you're gonna love this. Come here. You are just going to submit your book to that. Uh, sure. 
You like fitness. You like to run. Run places. Okay, you're, I'm gonna f have him finish up this and uh, just go to sleep. He is very, he's a very tired little, little kiddo. Updates, reply to comments. The most recent book, Celine Road has been nominated for award. Check out the next award ceremony at 7 p.m. to see if he won. Really? So he's getting an award, but, but diabetes is not. Amazing. So every so often I get to take a recruit up for his first flight in a fighter because the trainer planes are just boring old civilian jets. I see. Right. Uh... Let's have him start another book. And the award ceremonies are on Sunday, right? Yes, okay. All right, what kind of book, what book do we want to write, guys? Have like a mystery book. Does anyone have a good mystery book name? We could, uh... Hello! Hi, paparazzi! Oh, I can mentor him in acting? That wasn't what I was, uh, I was planning on doing. I was actually gonna... Post for some pictures. Huh? Take my picture, bro! <laughs> Dive is just like, hello! Hi, would you, would you like to snap a photo? He's like, um... I don't know. What the murder tried to eat my ass? Okay. Actually a love story. Way in. Um it, it the consist of ass, that was funny to me. The mystery book. Well, this isn't really working, but then we can, uh, let's try something else then. Make him swoon. You're standing outside my house. You're standing outside my house. Oh, he's, he's dead. All right. See you later. He's sitting outside my house, but he's like not interested. <laughs> well, of course, they're excited. Their first time going going all speedy. He is super tired though, so we are good. Butler, please. We are gonna stop writing for now and uh get some rest. Where are you going? Me tells him to get some rest. Salim literally walks outdoors. Uh, dude? Dude. Bro. Dude, dude. <laughs> are you good? <laughs> he doesn't have, he doesn't actually have the... You came out here to take pictures of your wife. You just took the buff for sleeping, that was fucking weird. He just had like a celebrity sighting reaction to his own wife. Um, bro, you you know she's famous. Like, you married her before she was famous. But okay, what whatever floats your boat, dude. Listen, listen to your heart and all that. Yeah, she's off. How are you doing? You're just chilling here. Are my sims not... Oh my gosh, autonomy was off. That's why they were so well behaved. Um, I figured. I was the taco cat. I'll show you in a minute, because there's an ad. Roscoe, if you're back from, uh, back from ad land. Here's Taco. Here's the Taco Cat. Jack is doing pretty well. Oh, good. Glad you didn't get one. Well, here he is. Uh, sniffing the garbage can. For whatever reason. Uh, we had a burn it down earlier, right? And, uh, and Taco Cat reigns supreme. 
No, no death for Taco Cat, only life. Everyone else died, but Taco Cat did not. Hello. Sniff, just sniff the counter. Taco Cat in the wild. Oh God. Oh God. He's he's off. He's off. You're home. Peanut butter. I need you to eat so we can go kill the the mommy plant. Can you have some pancakes that actually will fill you? And just go take a shower, and then we're gonna head off to after Strangerville. It thinks you're over there. You, you know? Yeah, there you go. No, the real annoying part of ad blocker is not when it is working on places you are not subscribed to. It's what it makes Twitch push ads to you on places that you are subscribed to. You're like, excuse me? Apparently, today is prank day. It's also the Starlight Accolades, but but specifically for Salim, which is extremely random considering how many times Diabetes has done stuff. Alright, we're going. We're going out. Get out of the shower, boy. Time to go. You're just black thing. Well, I'm very glad that you're just working. Mine was giving me ads on my own stream manager again. Woohoo. Okay, we need people to help us fight. Yeah. Which is like, here, have this random ad on your own stream manager. I'm like, bro, that's, I am, I am definitely subscribed to myself. <laughs> All right, everybody, if you'll just come this way, we are going to head into the building and fight the mother plant. I will just be using my key card. Uh, please do not worry about the fact that you are not wearing a hazmat suit, although, uh, I will be wearing one. Uh, if you'll just continue to follow me downstairs. Everybody, yes, okay, we're just gonna use a key card on this, cool, cool, everybody, everybody continue, we're all, we're all gonna group up down here, if you could, uh, follow me. Follow, continue to follow me to this location, yes, uh, you Oh, everybody's getting there. Awesome. That's good news. Good news. Everybody's together. Oh, we're gonna go in. Okay, cool. Everybody is here and ready to fight the mother plant. These are some great battle costumes, ladies. Um, these are just all people that help me with the quest. Do we get paid for that ad? I don't know. I don't really get paid for the ads. Let's be fair. All right, everybody inside. No running away. We're gonna fight the mother plant together. All right. Are you ready? This stuff has um has music. So <sighs> let's just okie dokie. Artichoke fight mother plant with. Oh, what head? Head's not here, but that's fine, I guess. Oh, I guess Ted's helping because, you know what, why not? Here. Throw. Throw them. Throw the vaccines. Throw the vaccines. Throw the vaccines. Use a mega spray. Do it. Big spray, yes. Go. Get them. Throw it again! Throw! Yes! Group commands! Warbly growth! War fry! Does less damage. Your team deals more damage, becomes infected faster. Resist infection but deals less damage. Heals some of their infection but does no damage. Okay, let's do a breather real quick. There we go. 
All right. Keep fighting. Keep fighting. Yes, now we are actively attacking it. Destroy! Destroy the pl other plant! I can't do anything specific because it's too dangerous, apparently. Fight! Fight, my friends! Destroy it! Destroy it! Throw the vaccines! Throw them! Go, Ted! Kick his ass! Go! Destroy! Go! Charge! Charge! Ah! Very angry. Charge! Yes! Get him! Get the mother plant! Destroy the mother plant! Pretty sure this is an insecticide. It's not. It's not a vaccine. But it's fine. Kill it all. Ah, goodbye, mommy plant. Goodbye. Oh God, we're getting beat up. Jesus Christ. Kick its ass. Oh, oh. Mommy's dead. Oh my gosh. Da 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 da. <laughs> we did it. There are two of them are, we're not possessed, but there are random possessed people around the side. See, they're just like random. They're just gonna go, I guess. Um, cool, we have a couple of extra infection vaccines, which is nice, the way I said that. I'm gonna miss, but. <laughs> Revive the mother plant. I feel like this is a strange. They're getting beat up by these people. Just go home. All right, everybody out. Hang on. I may or may not be doing this now that my thing is gone. <laughs> Happy prank day, everyone. <laughs> Jokes on you guys. Bobby plants back. Request weirdness. Okay, so this is like, we can turn back on stuff. Oh, and we're full. We're full because we brought her back. <laughs> That's great. Okay, we can ask her for fruit and, and return us back to old parts of the infection. So these are different stages. You have like stage one, stage two, stage three of the infection. Um, so we technically made it to stage four, uh, which is completing everything. So yeah, we did it. But now that we've resurrected Mommy Plant, we can always come back here and request things like energy, life extension, riches, and career success once a day. Um, so I'm gonna request, um, I'm gonna request some energy. I'm assuming this will just fill my regular energy bar. Like I'm guessing that's what it is, but it might just also give me a buff that like makes energy. Yeah. Okay. So. I have overwhelming power for 24 hours. I don't know if that means this won't go down, but here we go. Mommy plant is back. Yeah, I revived, we revived mommy. Mother has returned. <laughs> but we've uh, essentially fixed all of the, the issues. I'm gonna just pop over here and see if it says anything about the fact that we finished the quest. Um. But yeah, that is how the Strangerville quest goes. Spoiler alert. Um, there's no like branching paths or anything. It's a, yeah, it's a like linear storyline. But yeah, here we go. A little less Strangerville with one less screech. The mother plant collapses. Returning home, you notice things are beginning to return to normal. The bizarre plants are subsiding and the affected are waking up from their nightmare. Strangerville owes you a huge debt. You are a hometown hero. You defeat the mother plant and return Strangerville to normal. You can return to the mother plant at any point to where you awaken her once resurrected. You can never set the infection level to your desired strangeness. This will allow you to replay the story with other families. So, uh, for us, that just means that everything we're gonna leave it on normal, but we're gonna keep her alive so we can, <laughs> we can go get 
stuff from her. Um, also, can I just visit a random house in the planet? Of course, wherever you want to go. Um, oh, also, the thing where it reset his life, uh, since it's a cadet sim, meaning it's not the air, I'm not worried about it, but, um, let's go to this random empty lot. Uh, but it, if we were to do that with diabetes, we could only do it once, and that would be the only, uh, life reset we could do on her, um, which is how it works in legacy saves. Here you go! This is uh, just a random one of these houses. I, the type of architecture they use uh, in StrangerVille is actually really fun. Um, yeah, these are these are the plateau houses. It's really pretty up here. I like it a lot. But there's not a ton of reason to come up here because it's just like cool, a singular fishing spot unless you brought us them up here to live. Right, so it's just like, yay. <laughs> There's a rest stop, which like is not functional, but the concept is cool. Sometimes, the, as they made different sim neighborhoods, they got more and more elaborate with like the set dressing. Um, so like the more recent towns, there's a lot of stuff that you just can't interact with, but it's there. Uh, and that's just honestly like, yeah, I get that normally they wouldn't have just they would have just not made a lot more set dressing and there wouldn't be anything to interact with but now it makes you want to interact with it and so it's just disappointing the goth has in the default town yeah there's a there's a name for the type of gothic this is but it is a type of gothic uh architecture um i spent some time doing research on the different towns uh where they're based on the like inspiration behind them yeah, Victorian, but it's called Gothic something, this particular type of house. Um, and like, you know, what the architecture is and like, blah, 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 so I could get a good idea of like, where and how these uh, towns are supposed to, you know, look, look like and what the people are supposed to be like. Um, obviously, this is very like Area 51, <laughs> like area sort of nonsense, but yeah. Uh, this is a, I can't remember the name of this type of, of architecture, but it does have gothic in it. Uh, but yeah, definitely based on like a Victorian sort of era. But it's very specific uh, because it also includes that kind of like Western, uh, Wild West sort of uh, store, the ones with like the storefront bits. I can't remember what it's called. It's called something. They're all called something. I can't remember right now. <laughs> I'm gonna look it up. Hang on. What's it called when they have... Oh, I didn't turn this off. I didn't change the music back. Alright. So there's a name for the type of ones that have like... The, yeah, false front architecture. Uh... sod architecture you want to see all the dlc maps i have i don't have everything installed um because we like you like i only install up to like the latest thing um so i don't have everything right now gothic revival style because it's sorry i'm reading because it's um wood instead of stone yeah i do so much you know um and it 
happen like in America specifically. So, yeah, it's the Gothic revival style. Yeah, so this is um this is the base game. Samashino area. It's like I can't just pick one place cuz they're all like different areas, you know, like the there I won't be able to look it's five. This is why it's all. And then like going, but go, like going to the penthouses put you up top, but it, you can still walk around. We've been to this particular area a lot. We'll just not. Hey Tess, how are you doing? Welcome to us exploring a couple of the uh, maps for Roscoe here. We just, uh, we just murdered mommy plant and then brought her back to life. It was all good. Hydrate, thank you very much. Every time I load somewhere new, it tells me one build item has been removed. You are tired, but doing okay? I'm glad you're doing okay. So, this is like just the gym, but this is like the high rise, super swanky area. There's like a little, there's little shops and stuff that pop up. Uh, I don't think that I, I can't hit. oh he's not at the shop yeah so he has like different stuff but some a lot of the time there's a cupcake cupcake vendor up here which was really funny uh, and and amusing to me um yeah I can go over to the apartment if you want to see what that's like I had a Mountain Dew for the first time in years today uh how how did you enjoy it after not having it for a really long time So different apartment buildings, Roscoe will have different numbers of units in it, but you can only be on one floor um, at a time. So I'm actually a huge fan of these, like the Spice District. So we'll go over there. Uh, for me, city living is one of the my like, I need to have it in my game <laughs> ones. Uh, I spend, we spend a lot of time playing here, which is why we don't play as often. So we don't live here, so we can't like go inside the apartments, but they are, they are full of furniture and stuff. This is just kind of what it looks like. Um, when you're, you're just here. So see, yeah, it's like a shell and then there'll be apartments inside. And they don't necessarily have to be at the top. But I really like this area. Like, you know, port side. I can, yes. But it still won't show you the other apartment because technically we're in another lot. Yeah, see. So you can edit, um, in the base game anyway, if you're not using mods, you can edit like the apartment walls and stuff, but you can't edit the outside. So the, the door has to stay, the windows have to stay, but everything inside those Boop. sections can change. Boop. Um, but if you have a Twisted Mexi's tool, you can move the windows and the... <laughs> and you can move them around like everywhere. So you don't even have to you know, change the whole apartment if you want. Eh, oh, there's just nobody, nobody's living here right now, so. But yeah, there's the apartments here and also over there. Uh, yeah. yeah, I really, I just like this section of the world. I think it's really, I don't know. It just feels more like uh, somewhere that exists, you know, like a real place as opposed to up top where it's just like craziness. And I'm like, that's, that's, uh, that's not real. You want an apartment with no windows, only darkness to reign your chaos? <laughs> I mean, look, whatever you want, man. But yeah, the set dressing is super, super cool in this game. Uh, this neighborhood. But yeah, most people are like, they just complain that you can't go to everywhere. But it's like, do you want them to just leave it then? 
Because it would crash people's little laptops. Like half the people who play The Sims only use little laptops. Yeah, I go over there, but it's fine. And oddly enough, there is like a fishing spot, but on the wharf over there. <laughs> It's kind of weird for me to look at this stuff with just base game because I'm used to um, having all like redecorated things. We're gonna take we're gonna take him back to the house because we need to get Ivy to do her thing. It's gonna crash because of the bugs and not because of an overabundance of content. Ivy, it can crash because of both. No, honestly, my experience with crashes in particular is that it's because I have a bad mod or there's like a, there'll be a crash bug but they'll fix it the next day and that's it. Bugs in The Sims for me are like teleporting and them not understanding that they can go over to the table to eat. Uh, it's said uh, they stand in front of the fridge and stuff like that. It's very really annoying. A bad mod, yeah. Mine are always are usually mod related. Yeah, he is not losing energy. Like this is just energy, energy, energy plus. Okay, so he has totally done Strangerville mystery. Um, so I'm gonna check out something different. <laughs> yeah, okay. Um, the computer whiz would be pretty useful for him since he's already in. Yeah, he's already <laughs> in that you know, things, so we'll just do that. Maintain focus for two hours straight of video gaming. I don't think it will overwhelm this buff right now, so we're just gonna leave him to do his thing. How are we doing? So it's two hours until, uh, oh no, 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 it's not. We don't have to go today, but she can work on this stuff. Um, let's get everyone's uh, energy all the way up, just because like, for whatever reason, they did not see as I was away, and they don't do what they're supposed to do when I'm away. Your big one with the game is often if my sims are on the stairs and I stay the same. Mine are that too, but they phase up here into this little hole. <laughs> they like to go up there for a while. I had it open so they could just get out, but I kept having to let them get them to teleport. Um. God, everyone's so tired. Like, why don't y'all sleep? I leave you here. You do everything except the thing you're supposed to do. Oh, go, go, go. Yeah, so we have um, scouts today. That's the, the I think that's the first thing that's gonna happen. Um, yeah, so he's, it's just scouts with him and then uh, the award ceremony is tonight. We'll go there. The bathroom you put under the staircase into one of your houses. Yeah, just wherever. Uh, I, I don't know. The stairs has some whatever coding they use for for stairs, like getting up and down from one floor to another. So the Sims like understand that they're on another floor. It's always been a little bit, a little bit buggy. At least more than one Sim can walk up and down the stairs at a time. But yeah, they definitely can't. He's just crying over his dead father. Okay. Um. But they definitely can't like stop when they're on the stairs and turn around because like they don't seem to understand like they won't understand where they are like to do that and yeah they definitely have weird paths i told you to go to sleep is it because the cat's on your bed oh no no the toilet okay. i told you all to get some rest Look what you're doing, not getting rest. Well, you don't have to get rest. I suppose you can take this off now. We fixed it, it's okay. You need to a child, right? I forgot. So our little, our little nerd here um, says he won't be able to get the focus buff for a while. We're just gonna have him play video games and chill. He's supposed to do all this stuff for work, but like he hasn't worked for two days. I used to made focus for that one. Oh, okay, you're up. Hello, diabetes. How are you doing? Can you do the upgrades? I don't think you can do a lot of upgrades yet, cause you're. I don't remember what level she is actually. I have no idea. 
I don't know what I'm saying because I don't know. Yeah, so she just wants, she just really needs to receive an award and they won't give her an award. <laughs> so, okay. Um, watch action TV while she's doing that. Mm -hmm. All right, we'll follow her around. Oh! That is so many things. The flea market. Well, I'm good. She's feeling flirty because that person just called her very hot on the phone. Yep. Get your, get your outfit on. Let's go! Run time, diabetes! There. So she needs to work out to develop her fitness skill. And then we'll be able to do some of the other things. Yeah. I'm just gonna leave him. I mean, he's not gonna be tired anytime soon. I'm sure he can take care of himself. Uh, it's like 10. How are we doing? Okay, you're, all, you're like ready to go. Come on. Time to get up. Actually, I have something for them to do today, so I'm gonna go deal with the premixed brownies and, and stuff. You too, actually, when you're done. <laughs> I'm sure she gets a good mood when she gets called very hot over the phone, but when I call up random people, they just, to do the same, I just get, oh my god, creep. <laughs> I don't know why I needed that voice. You're dead. Um, they would stop calling me up from the grave to go to the flea market, though. So. I'm never taking a brisk sour shower. Shower? Shower? hour. So she doesn't lose uh, stuff. And you can also come get brownies or cake or whatever. How are you doing? 2% still? Run faster, motherfucker! Okay, he's gonna be in a great mood. So... Alright, and... Play chess afterward. It's all done. Okay. Okay, why don't you come here for me for a second. Um, let's do... I think it might be under home. Yeah, have a science baby. So I, I imagine that diabetes is just, she's not interested in being like pregnant and dealing with birth. So she's just like, we're gonna go make a baby in a test tube again. And he's like, sure, whatever you want, honey. I can't remember if he goes with it. He must. Yeah, yes, yes. Yeah, okay, he's just here, I guess. Oh, he goes, okay. To can now take family leave. Yep, she's just gone off to have a baby. Goodbye. He's like, hang on, you need my sperm! The weird thing to shout. It's a girl! Okay. Uh, Kindle, if it is a female, is it still Chungus? This feels like an important question I need to ask before I name it. Chug this the third. All right, Chug this the third. Legacy, welcome to the household. Yo, there's little Chug is the third. Chug is that. Gotcha. Well, and then we have a baby. No need for any of that pregnancy stuff. All good. Uh, so, baby's here. We're gonna just go get some food. Seems like a good compromise. Excuse me? Excuse me? I'm trying to get, I'm trying to get food. Could you get out of my way? 
breadstick time. Really? Really, Salim? Just move. Just move. That's right, honey. Teach the naughty test tube a lesson. This is the weirdest cuckolding ever. <laughs> Why can't it be that easy IRL? Right? Just head over to... Just head over to the local science lab. Be like... Yeah. Yeah, no, we, uh... We're just gonna have a baby now. Like, cool. Talk about your dreams. Oh, he's up. Hey, oh. But you're just... You haven't... And you don't have any actions. What are you doing? Okay. I mean, I know he's eating pancakes, but they, they aren't... They don't have any actions that are telling them that they're gonna eat pancakes. Science babies don't exist here. We're too far behind. Need some science babies, man. Mm -hmm. Ah, he's going to scouts. He's like, oh my god, I'm sleepy through scouts. This is the worst. Here. Uh, why don't you get the mail, kiddo? Is it a, is it a flirty ass mood? Uh, maybe like, yeah, go take care of your new child. I don't know. Yeah, she has, apparently she has a whole heart a bit with uh, Trigus the Third. What a bliss this new baby brings to Diabetes' life. They're just, they're chilling. Hey. Salim, what was in there? What was in the mailbox, Salim? Oh! Yeah, we get, uh... We get these for being a celebrity. Boost your skill gain side effect. Sense of happiness. Boost your skill gain side effect. Feeling flirtatious. Consult a doctor if this effect lasts more than three hours. Boost your skill gain. Four hours of energy. So these are for diabetes, technically. Um, oh god, Jesus Christ. Where are we going? You can just have a baby over three parents? Cool! Sounds like a good time. Right, we're gonna have... Zoom writing how the murderer ate by try to eat by ass. We have a few hours until the um this award ceremony we're supposed to go to. <laughs> Is he fabulous? Just hang it out. Hey everyone. Who's the boss, badge? There's a big, there's a big deal kid in Jimmy's Two Feet's troop who's renowned for impressing his bat, his impressive baggage collection. Jimmy Two Feet's recent accomplishments have made him feel like his collection might be. You have one badge, so no, don't do that. <laughs> it's like you should have done that. I'm like no, I shouldn't have. We're still the phase of everyone getting in the city. Getting the city hooked up to sewer systems? Oh god! Jesus Christ! That sounds terrible. I don't know what he's doing, but he's like. Duh. Okay. They're just hanging out, just having a good time. Man, I can't believe he's level 6 of Mixology, it's just from him randomly going over there to, to do mixology without me telling him to. Like, that's literally the only. Alright, everybody post on their social media, please. Here, you go over here and do- oh, actually, never mind. You don't live up there anymore. Go over to your computer and, uh, put some stuff. You can also advertise products, but I think that might just lose fans and we don't need the money. Jimmy's back! Hey yo. Alright, kiddo, you're hungry. Why don't you get some leftovers? Finished frittata, sounds good to me. He's like, honey, you're home! Like how he's just like ignored the fact that there's a newborn baby and he's just like, gotta write a book. Gotta write a book about ass eating. It's really important, honey, I swear. Oh my god, you're home! Hey 
<laughs> she, he's like ignoring her to go talk to dad. Okay, um, why don't you instead, you just eat. Eat your food and then you can set the table afterwards here. Set the table. I want her to make, oh God, playful. I want her to cook a meal because we're running low on food. Fruit salad it is. Off you go. Doing okay. Doing great. Excited from watching her baby. All right, let's uh, remix this track and burn it. I don't know if they're like, it makes a difference if we do this stuff or not, but I do it all anyway. It sounds better when you've got them on. Lukewarm and slightly chilly, the song. <laughs> That's the hilarious name for a song, actually. Okay. Oh no, baby! Baby, cry! Get up! Get up! Salim, get up! Salim, stop! He, he won't. St just stop. Bro. Oh, he was in the middle. Okay. Finished writing a another good book. Why can't you. Why can't you take care of your child? Hello? 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 Feed the feed the baby. Feed it. What how come you don't know how to get to your kid? Because your wife knew how to get to your kid. No, oh, butler? Butler, fuck off. Butler, I will murder you. I swear to god. Go away. Fine task, fuck off. God. Okay, yeah, I get it. Can I bottle feed the child? Or are you just gonna stand in front? Go to sleep. Assign, assign task, go to sleep. Bro, go pee. If you need to pee, go pee. Don't just stand there and stare at me. Butler didn't even wasn't even helpful. Look, just be friends with whoever you want. I don't I don't care. God, she's down. She's all the way downstairs. We have to go to the awards ceremony like now. Our baby is crying. My God. Okay, look, Salim. Someone will take figure out what's wrong with your child. We're going. Let's go. Okay, we're gonna be heading over to Delsil Valley, which we don't go over to very often because it's literally just like the same thing except for the award place, which I'm pretty sure is this. Um, for this. Where is it? Where am I supposed to go? What do you want from me? I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> Where am I going? Down here. Check out the award. Just check out the award ceremony on Sunday. Okay, hang on. I will, but like on the calendar. Go to event. Yes. Take your wife. Yes. Okay, they're going. There. Sure. This works. Okay. <laughs> it is a studio PBP. B P P B B B Q B B C <laughs> Dabby just want you there. Cue the music, it's time for the Starlight Accolades. And she's just like, ah, yes, yes. I am amazing. I am gorgeous. Love me. Okay, this is the host. These people are here. Polyota is famous too. Fan. All right, I assume we're supposed to sit down. There are six seats in this this lot. Amazing. This is like the like place that you're supposed to go to like the Oscars basically too. And there are six seats. And okay, all right, it's all good. Um, I'll let's just go inside, I guess. Um, Like, there are paparazzi outside, though. <laughs> no, 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 don't. 
a watch. Yes, watch. Sorry. Watch. Watch. No, don't tell jokes. Where's your husband? Watch together. Oh, he is viewing there. So there are celebrity like tiles. I think we can have one. Apparently not taking care of yourself. Okay, are you? Why are you staring at that instead of coming over here? You literally have an award. Go. You can't go because Dirk Dreamer has won this the Starlight Accolade. Oh, he can't get in because there's a bouncer now. Okay. <laughs> he's not allowed in because the f his fame requirement is too low. He's he's famous too low to go inside. But he, he's the one. Wait, what? She won at an award? He's the one who was <laughs> who was nominated. Okay, I didn't know she was nominated. She's still wearing her her outfit. Wow, this is amazing. Um, okay. Could you at least pretend you care? So Diabetes Legacy won the Starlight Act Alive for Best Acting. If she accepts the award, you can find it in her inventory. I, how do I accept the award? How do I do that? How do I say, yes, I would like to be famous? I don't know how you, I don't know how you do that. Make yourself swoon, Yusef. Oh, sorry, I thought it said yourself, and I was like, why? Why accept an award? What? Here, just watch. There's all these people and they can't get in. And he's just like, yeah, I'm here. Here, copy your book while you're busy. She stole my look. How do I... You run the Starlight Accolade for Best Acting again? Or your Sims household inventory? Well, how do I know if I've accepted it? If she chooses to accept it. The <laughs> fuck? Oh, hang on, I'm gonna make myself shiny again. I don't know what I'm supposed to do. <laughs> Me just like, I don't understand this. I don't understand anything that's happening. We're just like out here like, yeah, I can't get in either. Hang on. Okay, I was like, are you guys famous? Or who are you? <laughs> Everyone in here is famous. <laughs> who is our co-star that we're supposed to make friends with? Like, it says we're supposed to have to her. It says we have to make develop friendship with our co-star. Rear panel to get to know them. Invite over director and co-star from the career Oh, is this Oh, okay. How do I accept it? it? Says if I if I accept it. How do I accept it? Are we? Where are we still here? How have I gotten two awards? <laughs> hang, hang on. Starlight accolades Sims Four. Accept. How to accept Starlight accolades Sims Four? If you see a notification, click on the microphone immediately and select accept. Oh, accept award or acceptance speech. I think. Okay, there we go. She's she's doing it. Oh my god, thank you so much for this opportunity for me to be amazing and shine like the star I am. I always knew I would get here. Thank you. Thank you so much. That's just what I imagined she's saying. Alright, are you done? I'm still making it. He's just outside, like, on his phone. Like, I can't get into the event, babe. Oh, she just got in a fight with the bouncer. Oh my god. Um, right. Anywho. Do we get the award in our... You know what? I need to pee. You... You go home. I'm sorry. You can't, like, you can't go inside, so just go home, I guess, because you have to pee. <laughs> See you. Dustin Brooke won the Starlight Award for Best Performance. Okay. Oh, hey, this is my, this is her, like, friend. Judith. Hey, Judith. 
we extremely luckily uh, were able to befriend Judith pretty early on, uh, which is great for you know when you're you're you're, you're trying to become a better celebrity because she's a global superstar, and they like sit here and hang out with Judith. That concludes tonight's award ceremony. Thank you. I'm sure this would have gone faster if I had like accepted my award earlier. I just kept doing it over and over again. She just sat on the fucking floor. Ma'am, there are ch there are chairs. Okay. Well, it's fine. I'm sure. We're good friends and coworkers. Adoring sentiment. She's a mean, snobby person. That's fine. She's famous. All that matters. <laughs> All right, let's go outside. Yes, hello everyone, it's me. We're gonna pose for some pictures. She loves to pose for pictures. Yes, take my pic, take my pics. Oh, hell yeah, this is great. Look at all these people just coming up, taking my picture. Just standing in front of the, like, the door to where she came out of with the bouncer next to her. And, you know, she's just posing and all these people are taking pictures of her. That's top tier celebrity attitude. Oh, I, I got one of okay. Top tier celebrity attitude going on right here. I love it. We can flaunt our wealth by <laughs> making it, making it trickle, make it rain, make it pour, or money song? I don't know what any of this means, but I think it's great. All right, let's uh, fight some cheers. Hey everyone, get excited. Oh, she's not, she's not having it. She's like, this is a very strange location for you to be doing this. Are you famous? No, you just walk through that gate like just with absolutely nothing. Look, it's just like three stars. She's like, I need a drink. I do not care. Nobody cares about what you're doing. Yeah, freak people out instead. Seems like the right option. Okay, now that we've done all of that. So there are these, these things on the there are different people right so it's like octavia moon's uh thing we can deface the tiles if we had beef britney cho it's here we have dirk dreamer we have judith wards this is uh right here thorn bailey is over here i think uh we should I'm a global superstar. Okay, we gotta become a global superstar. <laughs> Why are you mad at it? <laughs> and then we can, uh, then we can do that. Well, as fun as staring at the ground has been, let's go home. Me being extremely confused about how to accept an award. I mean, to be fair, it was a little bit weird that you have to click on the microphone and not the person or like your your sim. But I feel like if anything, the the notification that comes up on the side should have an accept award button, or it should just push through for them to accept the award. Because why wouldn't you accept the award if you got bothered to go? Like that. That seems like an odd choice. Maybe really humble sims can like, can reject the award, but. All right, well, we tried feeding it and it didn't work. So, I don't know, try, oh, it's, try that. All right, welcome home, diabetes. I think she looks great. Uh, Did we have another formal outfit? No. I kind of feel like for Global Superstar Award accepting, we should definitely get like a very 
intense formal outfit. Uh, let's make a garden salad. Eat that. Um, she's good. She needs some social. Hello, you're just you're just working out. Okay. Well, you need to eat. That was apparently too fast. All right. Are you going to talk to a plant? You are. You know what? Okay. He's just drinking. Finds like one in the morning. And when you get some of that confetti cake, I need to I need to get rid of. And then after you're done. Oh, the kid is. Jesus Christ, stop crying. Go to sleep. Go to sleep, what the hell? What? I thought I asked him to swim to do this. Hello? Salim, come back here. Take care of your child. Why can't you reach it? Your wife can reach it. You could reach it earlier. Why can't you reach the child right now? Why not? What's wrong? No, this is an allowed spot. This has nothing to do with that. Frank Day was all, yeah, I didn't try. Oh, it's the You know what? You know what? No, no, no. You're not allowed to help. Oh, he, he fixed it. Oh, okay. Well, I guess you're fine then. But go away. Yeah, sure. Use a vacuum cleaner right next to my newborn child. That's fine. I don't care. Just stop that. <laughs> Do the laundry. Like, look at all these clothes. It just hasn't put them away. Like, yeah, you know. What are you even doing? Oh, you were eating. You stopped making garden salad halfway through so you could get different food. Let's see. I'm gonna sleep. She is. Apparently, she got stung by bees. Like, all right, but why? You put that laundry away. Where are you going? He's going to, to work out some more. How about you don't? It's cause he's, <laughs> it's just cause he's like super pumped from the mother plant, like decision or way that she's kept his energy. I was just like in a, in a great fucking mood. Great, fantastic. Like everybody needs to go to bed, just. Go to bed, I don't care. Oh, good job. Level 10 cooking, proud of you. Now go to sleep. Or clean that counter and, and then go to sleep. I didn't set this to auto light. I, though usually I set various like, um, lights in the bedrooms to auto light so that the bedroom kind of goes from like sleeping to awake but when I was building I wanted them on but the bro lift you can't skip leg day too bad leg day skipped I don't know it's a little bit you know it's more like someone's actually sleep oh, what are you a monster under your bed um the unsuccessfully attempted to communicate with the monster under your bed. all right um Carl, do you think you could come fix this since you're like not doing anything useful? Have I seen? I have not. I don't know what that means, but I have not. Um, I'm fascinated, but by this concept. But, but this is not who I asked to spray the monster under the bed. Girls got it. You did not need to wake up a secondary human. Like, can I go play the violin at 4 a.m.? No, no, you can't. I cannot play the violin at 4 a.m. No, stop that. Fucking stop that. Come back here. I know. You can't. You can't. But you're gonna lay down until... Until later, because... Not the time. Not the fucking time, child! Okay. What I was gonna do was auto-light... Auto-light this kid's room and see. <laughs> I 
if we can make it darker because it's like very bright in the, in the evenings, which is, you know, mostly my fault for putting string lights like literally everywhere. Yeah, no, it's like all, all, it's all the string lights are very bright. That's fine. Get up. Go back to sleep regularly. Okay, Monday morning, everyone's sleeping. All good. Okay, I think that's, that's where we'll stop for today. I know we're a few minutes early, but I don't wanna like get started on any day. It is Jimmy Two Feet's first day at school. Um, I think that'll be not fun. We'll have to start like teaching things Jimmy Two Feet, manners and character values, and especially scouts. I, I know that like we've done a lot of scouts, but scouts give such a powerful buff. Like the speed at which, hydrate, thank you. The speed at which diabetes can learn things is nonsense. So, Scouting aptitude is like a 20% buff or something, or 25. It's crazy. I don't even understand. <laughs> and uh, also, since she finally got that award, which Selim was supposed to get one, and then she got one, and I don't even understand what happened, but it's fine. Um, she just has to get to Global Superstar, which we can do by like selling some rockets. I'm trying not to just sell a bunch of random or donate a bunch of random crap, uh, but you know, she'll probably earn it anyway by just going to work uh, a few times. So yeah, just has to get to this. Um, I'll make sure to do these things so this thing goes well, and then she'll be all set. Also, we should have that accolade now in our, in our inventory. Did we not get did we not get it we accepted it excuse me excuse me i accepted my accolade where is it seriously did she like she not she didn't get it we did all that and she doesn't have the actual actual item it's going to kill some <laughs> dude can like is it a purchasable item now Like if you un if you're supposed to have it, it'll just unlock. Nope, I don't think so. I don't think she has it. No sales. Mm hmm hmm hmm. Why can I search it, but it didn't like show up? What? Starlight accolade. Would we just write star? See if it's here. <laughs> I can search it, but it doesn't show up, so I'm gonna guess we don't have it. <laughs> uh, darn. How how do we get it if it won't show up? Uh, we'll see if we can get another I'm sure she'll get another one if we just go next Sunday. Not, like, is there a inventory? Special drinks, little things. It's not like other phrase. I don't understand. I don't understand. Oh well. <laughs> Maybe they'll send it to us in the mail. It said it would be in my family inventory, but it's not. Like that's what the, the tool tip said, but it's not. Here. Oh, oh well. Oh well, we did our best. Okay. Save as. Legacy underscore challenge city. Cool. Did it? Thing did the we we murdered our poor mommy plant, and then we brought her back to life because obviously I cannot live a life without mommy plant. Um, we got we got awards. We got another baby. We got Chungus the third. Chung Chunget. <laughs> so that, that should be fun. Let's see if we're gonna be one around to rain. I'm tired. I'm tired, I just go lay down. Um, bitch. Let's see who's around. All right, we got sweet potato tot. We've got sets of rack. We have one sassy cat. We have 
lost Hannah. We have Incubaba. It's actually Incubaba. I don't know why I said it that way. Where's my list? Oh, okay. Here it is. And we should la raid Henna because Henna is like never on after me. So hopefully. Yeah, Chungus died, so we have Chungus the third. Hopefully, oh, she's only an hour in. Awesome, so Kenna's doing community night, which means that uh, if you wanna participate, they are usually allowing people if you're in the Discord. Um, I'm also gonna do a quick shout out for Hannah in here, not a clip kind, just a regular kind. Um, we're gonna head over there. So she's playing League right now. And if you wanna join her, I'm sure you can, but they, I'm assuming they're stacked. I don't know, they play a lot of customs. Uh, with people on the other team as well. So I'd be able to join in for some some community light, night league. Me, on the other hand, I will not be because I am tired. And I'll Thank you, Draco. Because I'm tired and also I don't play league that much anymore. Bad for me. <laughs> Good night, Draco. My lips like dry on the edge. <laughs> okay, we're gonna head over to the end screen. Let's go. Thank you guys for spending this wonderful, slightly different Friday evening with me. Um, we will be returning to Divinity Original Sin tomorrow for those who were hoping to see that tonight. Um, here is the raid message. If you guys would like to grab that and post that in the chat. In Hannah's chat when you come with me. Um, see you, Kindle. Um, there's nothing really to talk about because there's nothing special happening in the like very near future. Oh yes, Harry Harry Spotter. Thank you. You could post if you post in the Discord. I'll definitely remember. Um, yeah, I think that's it. Uh, so we're gonna head out. Did it cancel my raid? Oh no, I didn't do a raid. I didn't do I didn't even start it. Sarah, we need to talk. We're going. We're on our way. I'm on my way. Rapping at Nati. Those country lanes. You did not know me. I'm sorry. I'm stopping. Uh nope, it's just me. I did a shout out instead of the raid and I I it's just me. It's me, I'm the stupid one this time. <laughs> Twitch is often weird, but that one was my fault. <laughs> right, right, going, Henna, love her. If you're not following her, make sure to follow her, give her all of my love. I will see you guys tomorrow. I hope you're back. I hope you come back tomorrow to love me. All right, I'm going now. <laughs> Bye guys, bye guys. Have a good rest of your Friday night, good bye. Oh, thank you. Oh. Guys, target the fish. The fish has five, has five days.